full of danger and full of artistry, meant to astound the eye and capture the human soul. The name's Professor Gregorius T. Oswald. But my friends, and we're all friends here, call me G. We're all buddies Today's here, aren't we? This fantastical tale is the perilous journey of a boy named Kudoro. And I think he's done talking. I think that's it. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Sorry for what's the... What's that on your head, Rose? That little thing around here. What's that? Oh, my God. I thought you were going to say I've got, like, chocolate <laughs> on my face or something. No. Yeah. No, we got something that's exciting let's, to share. Let's say let's say hello to everyone first. Oh, okay. Hello, Fair Elf enough. Dave, for example. Elf one, Dave one. Just joined us on Buddy Games. Hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello. Hello, everyone in the chat. Hello, Frank, RT, Wuh. Hello, Archduke of Cruzia. Like oh, he's talking again. Hello, a 7 x Scott. <laughs> hello, Buddy Games, who is Liam behind the buttons today. To hello, Shadow Teal. Fly. Hello, Heinrich. Hello. Chocobo Breeder, Classic Gamer, Elaine, hello, 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 everyone. Sorry about our bit of a rocky start. Nico's yep. behind the buttons today, yep. and one moment he <laughs> tried to unmute the mic, and then he stopped streaming and started streaming immediately. <laughs> and, then, <yeah. laughs> and then he went on the wrong live screen. We were, we were supposed <laughs> to thank <laughs> Dran3 for the follow. Hello, Force Force Edge Edge. Edge. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to Body Games. Uh, yeah. Um, Rosie, what's that on your head? <laughs> I think you should explain what it is that is on well, our head. Because we need to dark. also update the Book of I Eternity. There's a lot of things happening over here the book at the of same eternity. time. Uh, yeah, so uh, first off, thank you all so much for Only watching our, f was it, three-part Secret Santa stream. Yes. Uh, we're now doing our finale. Basically, it's going to be a playthrough of Puppeteer. This was Rosie's idea. She thinks that... Um, well, what was it again? Um, you know, whenever at Christmas time, you usually get the big pantomime show, be it Cinderella, Jack and the Beanstalk, something that's got loads of, like, you know, uh, celebrities and stars in it and stuff. Well, so I thought, why don't we carry, like, come at Christmas from that angle and we play Puppeteer for the last stream before the Christmas break that for us it. here on Buddy Games. It was Games. a pantomime. I, was, I had to make sure yeah, I was going to say that right. Um, yeah, and that's our finale. Um, but the exciting thing about now. today is the fact that we finally have our new uh, audio setup. Woo! We need a couple of more things in order to get it perfect. But for for now, um, just the two of us, we could we, we will be able to do our streams. So, first off, I'd like to thank everyone uh, in Buddy Games that has been supporting us over the yes. past like four months for this setup. Um, because without you guys, this wouldn't have been possible. So we really hope that the sound is a lot better now. Um, but first off, if there's any problems with the sound like right now, please let us know, because it might be that uh, our microphones please might be too quiet or something. Or the game's too loud. To or to yeah, exactly. So just let us know, because this is our first time uh, testing things out. And Rosie... <laughs> Sorry, I'm just finishing with the Book of Eternity. Oh, it's and also, uh, first time in the chat as well. We've got a hello, love you guys from AlfDav1. <laughs> We've got a hello, hello from Check Your Watch 1. I need, I need to check some cables <laughs> quick, Rose. Hold up. I need to check some cables quick. <laughs> Hello, Rosie! <laughs> nice headphone you got there! Thank you, thank you, Mr. Dog. How are you I doing? I am Mr. Puppet for tonight. <laughs> Mr. Puppet! Uh, Mr. Puppet, indeed. You You're coming off camera, Mr. Puppet. Puppet. Oh, no. <laughs> no, I'm the star of the show. Hold on. Hello, everyone. So, if you give 1,500 channel points, you can activate me every 10 minutes and i will say hello rosie and read out any comment that you guys want okay anyways i'm off for now and i'll see you guys later bye bye candy gamer said you oh, are my, my new third Could, favorite uh, member of buddy games mr God, dog that was sorry there was like, something really awful underneath oh, here nico you missed huh. our, th our special guest mr oh, dog have a special guest mr oh my god is it liam oh hold up i'm <laughs> taking everything with me Gosh, <laughs> yes, it was Mr. Dog, you missed this Mr. Dog, but that's okay, that's okay. I'm sure Mr. Dog yeah, will hopefully be appearing. Yeah, I would love to meet him. Uh, but yeah. Uh, yeah, so this is a Puppeteer, and the Puppeteer is a, what some would believe to be a hidden gem Join on PlayStation. The reason why it's a hidden gem 
is because it came out very late Join in the PS3's life cycle. It came out in 2013. Uh, and in that time, um, obviously the PS4 was coming out, people were building up for that. Other consoles were coming out at the same time. So this game kind of went under the radar because of it. But it's made by Studio Japan. Wait, sorry? I Oh, sorry. I was just, just making sure the setup was all right. <laughs> uh, and it's it's made by, by Studio Japan. Yes. Which is the studio obviously behind games like Demon Souls and stuff. So some of the crew in Studio Japan that made games like Ape Escape and stuff were also responsible for this game. Yes. So that's really cool. And we've only played Curtain 1 of Act 1, um, but, you know, you can replay them. So we're going to be playing from the beginning. Yeah. So Join you can see this is my progress. I missed two of the heads, but that will all make sense. But luckily, we'll show all the cutscenes and everything, so you'll be experiencing this, like, you know, completely new and fresh. Yes. Um, oh, Alf Dad wants it. Where did Liam go? Liam is not here with us today, um, but he is there in the chat under Buddy Games. Yes. So if you miss Liam, feel free to just tag Buddy Games. I'm sure Liam can give you many fun facts about his life. Yeah, buddy. Uh, right now, he's Buddy Games in the chat. Yes. Um, let's, let's, let's. let's Let's play. Oh, Let's... the beginning of this scene. That's nice. They give you the option for that. Yeah, so because now I did a little test. Oh. Shh, shh. The, the, the theater starting. <coughs> Once upon a time, before everything went to rack and ruin, the moon realm was ruled by a beautiful goddess. But then, little bear, for whom the moon goddess had shown nothing but love, stole two of his mistress's precious possessions. A black moonstone and a magic pair of scissors known as Calibrus. After declaring himself Moon Bear King, he invaded the goddess's castle, one of your brothers. smashed the white Calibrus. moonstone to pieces. Once upon a time, I once upon a now. This is my moon king, so just get to the part where I sound good. <laughs> right, uh, yes, of course. <laughs> Wasn't everyone so very wowed when the moon goddess was obliterated? Wasn't it just great that the impressive moon bear king uh, gave a piece of the white moonstone to each of his generals, screwing over the moon at large? Oh yes, the next three years were something special. Ah, yes. Now, where do I begin? Where do you begin? I'll look into subtitles after this cutscene as well. So if you're wondering about subtitles, I will try to get them back up. Good shout, yeah. He was the Moon Realm's ruthless new king, and intent to oh, keep it that way. Sorry, this is so mesmerized, so night after night, he spirited away the souls of children and locked them inside wooden puppets who were doomed to defend Castle Grimmelstown. And while tonight was no exception, it would have been to be quite an exception. Goosebumps. <laughs> oh, the poor dearie. Look, Ying Yang. Another day, another soul. Poor indeed. You're as bad as the tyrant. How many of these children are you planning to parade off to <laughs> certain mutilation before you realize you're wasting your time? Why, one more? And then another after that. As many as it takes me to get my hands on Calibrus. <laughs> That's nice. Oh. oh, another one. Meet our hapless hero, who's just blitzed back to life, firmly in the Moonbear King's clutches. Kutaro. Kutaro. Your soul was summoned here at my behest. Kutaro, will you be my friend? Yes, yes, yes. Bows to the bitter yes. end. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. I hope it doesn't pick up the munching, actually. Come to think of it. I think it picks up the rapping. Lovely. Another dunce who left his head in the moon bear king's bed. Look, there I am. Listen. Da, 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 there we go. We're in the gameplay well, now. Where to start with this game? So many questions came up. So many. We're going to try and keep Come silent on. during the cutscene moments because, else. you know, that's. Uh, first of all, let me see if there's subtitles. Um, because, you know, this is a part of the. This is theatre. Maybe screen settings? Yeah, maybe screen settings. Uh, screen. 
Subtitles on. There we go. Boom. 3D mode. Remember when that was a thing? You can use a substitute head. Search. Right stick. Oh, so, yeah. So, there we go. So, I'm controlling the... Yes. The cat creature as well. Yeah, so let me just very quickly run it down because Althep won't ask a good question. Is this on PS4? No, it sadly is not. It is a PS3 game, um, and a lot of people are actually vouching for this game to come over to PlayStation 4. Um, yeah, if it comes out one day, I'd love to see this game getting remastered. But for now, it's sadly only on, on PS3. They may be weird, but they flap around with lots of useful heads. But one little touch. So I'm just remembering the controls the again. Yeah. You know, I know a what new kid on the chopping <laughs> block like you ought to have a couple of noggins at least. Can't take any Right, chances. yeah, so the premise is is that your head has basically just been pulled off. Um, but you're like this little puppet boy, so... Yeah, Kutaro, good, name. yeah so you're absolutely fine, but you're going to be finding different sort of things you could put on your head, and each one of those has different abilities. Yeah. And also, as you can probably tell, like, if you look up here, following Yin Yang the cat, it's all based on it being... <laughs> Like a theatrical performance. So if you hear like ooh's and ahs, yes. it's because we're in the theatre, which I think is a wonderful premise. And look, yeah. now I've got a spider head. So, so what's great about this game is are a couple of things. So everything is happening at the same time, as you can see, and the presentation constantly changes, which is great. It has this like grandiose sound, which is kind of like something you would hear in a game like Medieval or something. I think it's quite comparable. Um, sorry, it's because I need to find like a balance when I can talk to the game. Yeah, sorry, it's all too toil at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> so it, it might look like as if we're a bit boring right now, but it's only because we're trying to let the game talk as well. Okay, right, um, let's Yeah, so um, what's great about it is that you also have these, um, um, this almost like fourth wall in the game, because obviously it's all a theater act. Um, there's an audience to it, so sometimes you'll see like the railing on the top shake or the curtains move a little bit when things move around, or if there's like a monster coming out of the theater into the, the, the room, you hear audiences go, whoa, or something. It's, it's really great. That's got, look at this. It's so Look at this. good. That's so good. You'd better follow that fork. The witch doesn't take kindly to long range. Oh my god. I forgot how good this fork. game actually is. It's as Ugh. wicked as the witch. Right, there I am. Right. Da, 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 da. Hey, Ow. I warned you. <laughs> oh. And the audience laughs. And Remember they clap the for you. It's so good. No more heads means no more you. Yeah, so your heads are also pretty much your lives. So. Yeah. I'm going to do against this Oh, it's okay, it's okay, it likes me again. I will say as well that um, this game on the second hand market is going for quite some uh, some money right now. So if you are liking the look of this game, uh, and if you see a copy in the wild, get it. This game will be one of those gems that people will say like, oh, if you have PSV, if you like platformers, you've got to play this game. Oh, got to go in there. Um, Steinson did a highlight which These means we need to bring our little friend back. <laughs> oh yeah, whenever you highlight a message, Mr. Dog will be the one to read out your comment. Yeah, Mr. Puppet will read your comment out. Do different heads have different powers, Rosie? Careful. Well, yes, different heads do have different powers, so we're still in the tutorial at the moment, but I'm sure the game will be showing us, um, it's like, you know, just an example of what... Oh, gosh. I only realized that it takes 100 channel points. Like, everyone's going to do that now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, okay, right, so I've got to do it when the pot isn't hot. When the pot isn't hot. When the pot isn't hot. I've got to jump. Is a pot. When the pot is a pot. Pot, 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 pot. There we go, like this. Do you like them sausages, Rose? You see them sausages in the back. I wanted the moon spot, the sausages. There, look, oh, there yeah, we. There's the sausage. <laughs> Dancing little sausages. <laughs> and the eggs. Up we go, bonk. Oh, there was like a hop uh, button on the... Yeah, that could help Hello, you tell. Yes. Being one of oh, these hello, yes! We got a heli, yes! We got a heli, yes! yes. Merry Christmas, says Harpo Speaks! Merry Christmas, Harpo Speaks. Merry Christmas and you are going into the Book of Eternity! Oh. Yeah, for, for new viewers out there, we Just also have the Book of Eternity, so for any sub, follow, no, not follow, uh, sub, raid, um, uh, host, and donation that Sub you make towards donations hosts raids yeah and if you do any of those then you will go into the book of eternities which is a little book that we keep by and we keep track of everyone that does those things so yeah thank you so much you're now in the book of eternity you are now in the book of eternity 
Yeah, he started says all hail the book of eternity. Look at all, all those books. All hail the book of eternity. The book of eternity. Noted in the book of eternity. Mmm, <laughs> I smell something delicious. The witch couldn't. Oh, Burgers! Give me a burger! Oh, now you have the burger head. I love my burger head. Any ideas? Head action. Here we go. So then if you press down, that's going to be your ability. So this one. Head. Bread. Extends. Oh, How do I change that? Hmm. Hey, like here we go. Oh, we got another Helly, oh, yes! Oh, another Helly, yes! Yeah. Who says Book of Eternity? Uh, oh. <laughs> Eternity! Oh, yeah, you can also. Yeah, Book of Thank Eternity! Thank you so much, Hyperkandy! You are also going in the Book of Eternity! Bonk! Done! God, yeah, you, you really notice that you sometimes are like. Uh, that it's much harder to stream when it's just the two of us. Head. Bread. You know what Why I mean? are you not used to it? No, look, I, I need to keep track of two things at the same time, but yeah. Head. I forgot that you have like these head actions. So I've only played like the first chapter of this game. Uh, I just haven't really gotten around to play the rest of it, but um, Rosie and I have been kind of like waiting for the right moment to play this game. Uh, but today seemed like a very good day to, to play it because it's such a good feel good game and it, it's a hidden gem. It's just a fantastic a game that Sony pumped out once in 2013. Yeah. Uh, little fun fact for you, Rose. Mate, you may not know this, but uh, it, fun it turns out that PlayStation Access covered this game back in the day. They did, yeah. It was yeah. Rob who reviewed it, wasn't it? Yeah. So if you go type in PlayStation Access Puppeteer, you will actually find some like content that they made for it back then. Which is, uh, which I was quite surprised about when I when I uh, looked oh, some I didn't want to do that. Too. I wanted to look at the, the bits. No. As for Kutaro's catty companion, yeah, he's um, picking up bits. He used to be the moon. So I believe there were some people first time in chat as well who sadly we missed out on their comments oh? as well. I just want to make sure that everyone we get, say hello to everyone. Uh, full stage doer one who said hello, hello. I don't believe mm -hmm. we said their lovely comment, and then I think. Okay, Drone three point. says, "If my name gets confusing, feel free to feel free to just think that Dante from DMC and then add R." Okay. Got it. So Dronte. Dronte. <laughs> right. I got a bat. Oh god, it's flying. Yeah, okay, now you have a bat the, head. What can the bat do? You know, now you're a bat boy. No, 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 bat boy. Come on, pop. Yeah, I, I was wondering, chat. Well, like, what do you guys think of the the new microphones? Like, do you guys enjoy it? Do you guys think it's a step uh, forward for us? Because uh, it's a step back. Step backwards. Right? It's awful. Vegetables. And I hate you. I hear you too well. I hate your voices. You're too loud. Get out. Under the table. Oh, I didn't even see that. That's so cool. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I wanted to get the moon sparklies. Oh, we have got the. the Hurry moon. along now, dearie. She's me. Well, I mean, not that part. <laughs> <laughs> not the part where she wants to turn lazy boys into grub. My hat! My oh, hat! No, your no head. I lost one of my heads! Yeah, so Ooh, on the top left. It looks left, like he's doing a, a dance move. Du -du -du. Yeah, so on the top left, I believe if you lose one of your heads, you, you can still use one of your remaining heads. Yes, but it means you lose the ability to those heads. So if there's like a secret, for example, that needed the bat head, then I can't do that anymore because I lost the bat head. Okay. Uh, A7 Scott says, Yes, you both sound good. And Buddy Games as well says, I like them. Sad I can't use them today. <laughs> oh, it's okay, Liam. <laughs> Ooh, um, yeah, because uh, we want to get an, another pair of headphones, but um, Liam needed a couple of more things extra with this setup, so rather than getting like a third headset, we decided to get those things instead. Um, but for now, for like for two people, we could use this uh, setup from here on out, so that's great. Uh, Archduke says, there's something about this game that reminds me of Medieval. I think it's its theatrical presentation that it just absolutely nails. Um... Where is Rain? Strange, isn't it? Strange! strange. strange. Isn't I thought I was part of the show! <laughs> but wonderful! You. Strange, but That's wonderful! Spencer, you're going in the Book of Eternity. Book of Eternity! So so oh no, I spelled your name help. wrong! <laughs> Wait, Not until you march there we go. And I did it. Magic scissors? Magic scissors? 
After all, Look at all the things she's got in her hair. Very mm. special. And in her apron as well. There's even like little drawings on her apron. There's like so many tiny details How on these characters. Very special boys are we up to now? Yeah, yeah. You can keep him company. whoop de doo We get to go to the throne room to find Calibrus. Won't this be fun? It will be very fun, Ying Yang. <laughs> Stop that! It's a this is investigating everything. I was going to say examining and ing 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 Yeah, because you can play as the cat with the other thumbstick, right? Yes, so you control the main character with the left, and then with the right, you control Ying Yang, who is the cat. And then with R2, you can investigate Welcome things with Ying Yang. I can't help but just get a bit of uh, an Alice in Wonderland vibe from this cat. Don't let it yeah. It's like the purple like stripes and the, the mysteriousness of him. With nasty and also, he knows a lot. Because <laughs> the cat, I believe, in Alice in Wonderland knows a lot as well. My cat senses are deep. See? You yeah, I got my bat head back. Bat head. Bat boy, bat boy, bat boy. Bat boy, 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 Ah. If I put on my yeah, and, and the spider webs you can do stuff with uh, <gasps> later. Ooh, you sneaky rat! Can I attack? No, I can't attack yet. This is just a pure. <laughs> this is a platforming <laughs> extravaganza. Oh yeah, the cat. The cat talks like this. <laughs> no, that was because <laughs> no, the, the cat talks like this. No, 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 the tiger. Sorry. Oh yeah, the tiger talk like yeah. He was like. <laughs> There's a bit of a uh, Sean Connery going on. I know. I'm a fellow bat. I think it's because his teeth are like so together. That's just the only way he can talk. Do you think this is like foreshadowing the bosses in this I game? I think it actually is. It's a good shout. Oh, what have you got? <gasps> now you are a skeleton. You lost your bat, by the way. Look, you only got three slots in the top oh, left. Oh, what? I didn't know that was a thing. No! <laughs> Where's my bat head? You can't be bat boy, bat boy anyway. Bat boy, bat boy. Spiders, Rosie. Oh, the creepy ghoulies. Oh, Natalie Mundy has redeemed a Nightmare Before Christmas reference, Rose. Is the one with spiders in the in the movie? Uh, yeah. The, oh, gosh. Uh, oh, hang on. <gasps> oh, he's scared. <laughs> the boy. The boy, silly boy. Uh, yeah, there must be. Uh, hang on. Oh my God. I'm would, you, would you like me to play for a second? No! Ah! My skinny head! <laughs> Sorry, Natalie Mundy. So basically, um, Rosie has this thing where she knows almost the whole script of uh, Night Before Christmas in her head. And uh, for Christmas, we thought it was might be a good idea to, for Rosie to just name a quote for it. Yeah, that's right. They, again, Liam, they use the spiders used for the mayor's uh, tie. So you could do the... So you could do the thing where, like, the spider's trying to escape where he's, like, Jack Skeleton's whispery. He's like, I was and then that's when the mayor's like just trying to listen and then he hits the the what's it called the hello i'm speaking in a big tube yeah thing and then he puts his hand in it and goes ow and then the spider's like oh, to kick it up. and then he goes Bro, what's <laughs> there you go that's his nightmare before christmas spider reference mr fuzico says if you had a, a playstation move nico uh that could have been used to control yin yang so you can also use the, the move apparently for this game. Ah. Interesting. Uh, Zarek, immediately you're having no breaks, Rosie. Zarek redeemed a walking impression. Oh, kids. Mr. Walking, you sound very clean today. Oh, wow, kids. <laughs> my, my voice is always clean. You just gotta get me the right equipment. Who have I been working with the past six months? It's been the- Amateurs, that's I'm what. Tell Liam, I want a raise. <laughs> I think Walken deserves a bit more for appearing. Oh, no! My, my spider! Spider my just, spider! Whoa. Spider Games is posting the um, the hole emote as well. Ho! Brandon187 is uh, says, Oh, great to see Rosie again after watching the Christmas Maze on Axis. Hello, Brandon87. Yeah, hello! Welcome! Welcome to Buddy Games. I'm so thrilled that you are. Well, at least I'm hoping you're enjoying the Christmas Maze. Because I know that, well... Because we, we all worked very hard on it and we had a lot of fun making yeah. it. So I hope everyone's having just as much fun watching it as we had making it. I believe it was episode three that just went out today. So I won't say anything in case, like, you know, for spoilers or anything like that. Yeah. 
I've obviously, uh, I've seen your work behind the scenes and you've worked extremely hard Ooh. along with your team on the production of the Christmas Mace and uh, it really paid off, if you ask me. It, it looks fantastic. Oh, uh, thanks. Wait, okay, there's a secret thingy here for a spider. So if I do a spider action. Um. Whoop. Hello. Oh. What's this? What's this? Bonus level? Bonus it's a bonus stage. stage. Bonus stage. No, I think you've done this before, but you failed. Oh, that's right. I think I just immediately jumped off thinking that the rope spider was... Bum. Um, spider bum. Spider Look at me. I'm on a spider bum. Spider bum. Spider bum. Spider bum. Spider bum. Hard to keep track Remember, you have to grab all of them. Yep, I'm trying. Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ooh. Okay, Music I'm on the next this. bum. <laughs> I'm on the next bum. Ah, give me that one. Don't fall off. It's cool, I've got this. Look at me, I'm Bouncy Spider Bob Bum Boy. Bouncy Spider Bum Boy. Yeah, I remember boy. how brutal it was when you fell down um, last time we played it. Okay, I've got to go from hop buddy, hop buddy, hop buddy, hop. Oh, there's hop, a clock. Buddy, Rose, hop buddy, hop buddy, hop buddy, hop. Hop buddy, give me the big one, give me the big one. Yay! Yay! I did it! That did not look easy, actually, for your first uh, puzzle. Oh, that was actually that was a, that, ooh, a bit exciting. It's definitely like a bit of excitement. Oh, it's a bit of a um, mouse. It reminds me a bit of a Donkey Kong Country, mm. where you have like these secret levels that you can find with power-ups. <laughs> I'm a banana head. I'm <laughs> a banana head. Mm. So I was not expecting the banana mm. to look like that. <laughs> I'm a banana head. Does this mean I can like not slip? Can we? Can, if you, if you ever, if there ever was a day that produce would cover this can we get like a banana that looks exactly like that oh of course i mean it wouldn't be very hard we just have to get a banana and then give it some googly eyes and a big happy <laughs> smile <laughs> i want all my bananas to look like that no i'd love to cover this on I'll, produce i think this is a very produce i will pay double the money for for bananas that look like that i'll yeah, pay double, double the money, the money. So, yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's I'm not Rosie, I'm a designer. I don't earn that much. No one has ever made it this far. Well, it's because you haven't made some faces on bananas, Neeks. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Maybe people would ask double digits for that, yeah. Who knows? Oh. Stop see, I love madness. Did you guys see that? Like even the little cancer when he was launched forward with the stage, he was like, whoa! He almost whoa. fell over. It's like, so dynamic. What if she's right? <laughs> the sun does have a burning temper. Ah, what did he do? I've got his precious daughter. Of course you do, sire. And even if you didn't, your majesticalness is more than enough to eclipse the sun. I've prepared a very special room for you. My dear princess, so please, I insist, take a long rest. Meow. What luck. He's left Calibras unattended for mm. once. Kukaro, you are one lucky person. Not oh, cat puns. <laughs> cat puns! We love him, we love him. Can we have some cat puns in the chat, please? Oh dear, what have you done? Hero tower, <laughs> the most impressive pair of scissors you've ever seen. Look at them scissors! The legendary Calibris. They have some Bayonetta scissor vibes, I'd say. Oh my god, Bayonetta got a pair of scissors. Yeah. Put them on her shoes, and then like everything she did was just like... So with her, she had one on her leg, like her gun, so you'd have one on her at every foot, and she'd go like... Well, no, so she had them like, you know, clipping on her, like on her heel, so that when... Sometimes I forget how flexible you are. So that when she's like, you know, she's like, going yoink <laughs> with her feet. I'm like, whoa. So, you know, if she starts kicking away and stuff, you know, it goes, Benetta, you mystery. And then she like kicks and then yeah. it's like everything just gets sliced. <laughs> and honor me. Don't you see? Calibris has chosen you. Calibris has chosen me. 
I am the chosen boy with my banana face. And so Kutaro's fortunes were starting to look up. After all, he was now the proud owner of a pair of enchanted scissors. Yes! Still, it wasn't all good luck. Remember, Calibus belonged to the Moon Bear King. Not anymore! It's my pair of scissors! And the boy's first challenge was to That's extricate to go, himself snip, from snip, the booby snip, trap snip, he snip. just set off. Now, if you've played Astro's Playroom, you might have seen now, in the level uh, where you're in the frog you costume, there is a, oh, you're right. there's a bot with a pair of scissors, and it references this. It's so a this puppeteer is, reference. This is the yeah. puppeteer reference where you get the scissors and you can go snip, 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 snip. Snip, 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 snip. There. What is the number one cat social media platform? Twitter. I don't get that one. Oof, <laughs> sorry. Is there a cat breed? <laughs> Probably, yes. <yeah. laughs> no, I don't. I'm sorry, I don't get that one. Oh no! Oh, you got to be quicker. I got to be quicker. Okay. Yeah. Oh, a litter. I get it now. Oh, I get it now. a litter. A, li a litter. Oh, I get it. I get it now. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one, yeah. Snip, 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 snip. Science really no just needs a better audience, essentially. <laughs> yeah. It's not the joke, it's the audience. I kind of wanted Astro's Playroom to yes, last longer. You know well, uh, we'll see about that. Like, if, if we're going to see like any um, like sequels to wizard. it. I mean, I want more Astro's Playroom. Um, you're actually playing. You're right now in a session of trying to get the plat for Astro's Astro Box. Rescue, rescue mission, yeah. Yeah. Because Good I've been raving about that game towards Rose. You'd be like, Rose, you've got to finish this game. It is so good. And uh, finally, now that you're on your Christmas Don't break, now, you'll be able to play that game. Catch us. Sorry, I'm just slipping away. I was debating between... I wanted the bat head, and I was just like, oh, I've already had, like... Oh, ooh, that was close. But I've already had a spider Easter egg, so I think I'm going to try and sacrifice the spider. <laughs> Elaine says, is that the VR version? That's Astro the VR game, yes. Yeah. Astro Bolt is the VR game. Astro's Playroom it's is the... It's the PS5 game. Yeah. There's the hand of my property! My, my property! My, 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 my trap! you get out? Wait, how did you get in? <laughs> you wretch! What have you done to you through my throne room? What have you done to you? Apprehend that thief! <gasps> oh. Deathly and darkly, the grubs descended upon our trembling hero. But locked within each of them was the soul of a child, just as scared as him. They're heartless, Rose. Oh my god, it's the heartless. Wait, my head! My head! You see that? Slip, slip, slip. I did it. I cut off his head. <laughs> your head. Clean off your shoulders! Slip, 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 slip. You need a haircut, you need a haircut. Just like the rest of You need a haircut. Slip, snip, 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 snip. So, so yeah, guys, what do you guys think of this game so far? Um, because you hear rarely people talk about Puppeteer. I'll do it myself. Um, Xerox says, Astro's Playroom, Sackboy, Ratchet and Clank would be the games I would first play if I got a PS5. Um, my picks for... But if I got my PS5 first, would we'll probably be the same in all honesty. Uh, I would probably squirm in Demon Souls, but I'd probably be too scared to finish that game because it's really hard. <laughs> but I actually really enjoy my you enjoy different. watching from software. No, I also enjoy playing them, but I I'm, I definitely am still as green as grass with a what is it with a, a Souls game. It would probably be something I would preserve if I, if I would start streaming myself because apparently everyone says that your first run on Bloodborne is magical. Yeah. Your first run on Bloodborne is the, you know, that, that's a... The clash grew even oh, flashier. that's a story. That's the story time! My head! My head! Alphab1 says, I recently got the Demon Souls plan. Oh, that's well impressive. done. Well done. I kind of work on towards that one casually. Um, but I know that I've been talking to my friend Bart and he wants to pick up Demon Souls and potentially play it with me, so I think I might kind of work towards the plat as I'm playing the game with him. <laughs> snip, 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 take off your clothes! Get him. Take off your clothes! <laughs> <laughs> it's behind you! Oh, look at all this! Oh, this is so satisfying! I'm just. No! 
Slip off the woman! No! The weaver is full of souls, like the one you saw before. But cut oh, those do I have to start from the beginning because I missed you that one eye? No, 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 no. Ow! My head! You've lost your head. I suppose I'd better help you out again. Okay, there we go, there we go. Oh, can he actually... That single eye. Yay! Uh, we, got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. Uh, Zarek says, can't beat the second blo the boss on Bloodborne. Oh, wait, is that Father Gascoigne or um, the, the blood stuff? I mean, that depends on which ring you've taken. Yeah. I've got a crown. I am king. Look at that. I am so much king. heart in this I game. I am the king. King, king, king. Insomniac Glainer says, hey, everyone. Hello. Welcome back to Buddy Games. Yeah, it's like, uh, hello, welcome back. Um, also, Sarek, you might have noticed that um, you now have a different icon next to your name. Um, I've made sure that the silver icon, Rosie, is a six-month badge now. So anyone with a six-month badge now has a different badge. Well, he can't have gotten far, sire. He has such tiny legs. I imagine he's right around the corner. I don't want him around the corner. I want him cornered. Find that thief, or I'll find someone who can. Oh come on, who is that voice? Sucker? I know it sounds so they all sound so similar. I'll take care of it. Would you like a backdrop, a glass of warm milk? Now, no. obviously, this does not, this doesn't really necessarily dictate um, the what is it the production of it, but it's impressive to know that these games were made by Japanese people. Oh man up. Oh sorry, we've got a highlighted message. Oh no. And you know what that means, Nico? It's time I'll, for I'll all. I'll finish my story first yeah, sorry, before people this. misconstrued that. <laughs> but basically, of course, they have a different reference point than obviously you do here in the West. So some of these things are very unusual to them. So it's very like they've done an immense amount of research to just mm. absolutely nail this. Like absolutely commendable. It's like as if you have to do like research on a topic from a culture that you're not quite familiar with. So yeah. I, I just find that super impressive. Anyways, just popped back, and he says, "This narrator is giving me a Robert A. Pearson vibe." Robert A. Pearson is Robert A. Pearson, the, the second version of Robert S. Pearson. Robert S. Pearson. Maybe it's like a rank, you know, like an S rank and A rank. Um, but Zarek, if you want any tips on Father Gascoigne, if you want, there's an item which can be quite handy if you're struggling called the music box. Uh, if you get the music box by giving uh, an item to a little girl in the window. No, 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 you have to talk to a little girl in the window. She gives you the music box. If you use that music box, then it will help stun him for a bit. So if you're struggling, try the music box if you haven't already. But let's, hey, now you can see, this is my genuine say, we did Could level one and Nico and I were both like, talents, we want to share this with more people, so we've been saving it, so now we're going into unknown territory! But before he could start mm. cutting along the dotted line of destiny, he would have to escape the wrath of the tyrannical Moon Bear King. Moon Bear King. Let us continue our adventure. Does anyone else recognize these voices? Because they're so good. <laughs> Lucky Kutaro, suckered into stealing a set of sorcerer's scissors by the witch and stirring up oh, a tyrant's rage. Now, all his hopes of escaping the castle were dashed, just as he himself dashed like mad to outrun the soldier grubs who wanted his head. <laughs> Poor Kutaro. His only hopes now were Calibrus and a witch of most questionable character. What cruel tricks would fate play on him next? Dun, dun, dun. Ra, ba, boom. I'd probably say as well, I'm wearing my Christmas poncho. <laughs> you are, yeah. You pussy footy wussy cat, where were you? I ought to fudge! <laughs> Did you forget you sent us off in the first place? Yes, Calibrus chose him. Finally! Those legendary shears will cut right through the Moon Bear King's lackeys and set the Moon Rail free! Now, my brave young warrior, why don't you let Granny hold on to those for you? Right now, you wooden dolt! <laughs> What's that for? Don't you tell me I'm not yours! I'm not yours! 
madness. You need either a heart as pure as the goddesses, or pernicious magic like the Grizz. But all you've got is an attitude. <laughs> I just remember that we didn't inform the, the Discord that we went live. Oh no! Um, Liam, could you um, make a, a post about that with the everyone tagging it on the on the Discord? Thank you, Liam. And this egregiously foul odor must be witch stick. You are certain he's not here. Oh, yes, very certain your antagonists. <laughs> I beg you, bring that scoundrel Not to really justice. Like a, was it a compliment, is it? Is that? Uh, oh, you worry. rosiness. My See what I mean? Will have this whole castle locked down in no time. I wouldn't take that as an insult. <laughs> oh, the kids! No, that's Not the so... kids! No! They just they both just sleep there. Oh, they're on patrol. After all, we can't have anyone crashing the prison towers and making off with the night's powers. <laughs> now can we? Did you hear that, dear? Then get your hiney in gear! <gasps> The tiger's tongue had slipped. Whatever powers this knight had, they were clearly important. Ooh, okay, right. Here yeah. we go, into unknown territory. Uh, back head. You now also have the crown, and I bet you want to make sure you keep that crown for a little bit. Well, that's why I didn't want to... Yeah, I didn't want to swap that out yet, so... <laughs> I got banana boy, <laughs> crown, <laughs> and then my back head. Um... Oh, sorry, I saw a comment that I was going to read. Oh, yeah, Alf Davor said Robert A. Pearson actually creates difficult challenges. <laughs> no, they're, they're all really hard. They're all super. Like the Hitman one, I didn't think we were going. Well, the third episode, sorry, I didn't think we were. I'm, I, I'm not everyone seen the episode yet, so I'm going to stop talking. <laughs> but that one was very close. Whoop! The castle walls didn't come with stairs. Oh wait, wait, what's this? What's this one? What's this one? What's this one? What's this one? <gasps> giant living it's a boy girl. Uh, okay, banana for boy girl. Magic. Banana really? for boy. I mean, I would have a banana instead. What you mean in real life or in this game? <laughs> I mean, depends on the time of day. I will say, if it was dinner, I would probably take the burger. But if it was, uh, what is what it? What if it was lunch? If it was nah, I would take a banana. Cutting, slicing through the vines. Oh my god, there's so many different head objects. What do I want to keep? And the skeleton, but I want to keep the crown. Oh man, there's only different head options. Okay, I'm gonna keep the burger. Definitely keep the crown, though. Yeah, I'm gonna definitely That's keep sure. the crown. Okay. Maybe the bat. Uh, all right. Bat swap for Bony Boy. No, don't move. Um, yeah. No. And Sonic Lena says, no. I haven't seen it. And Sonic Lena says, I haven't seen it yet. Uh, I'm still stuck at work with uh, a Grinch Liam face with it. Oh, well, so, yeah. it works okay. Oh my god, this is scary. I'm gonna, I well, have to like... Yeah, I'm, I'm almost done, by the way. I'm almost on my, my Christmas break, so I'm looking very, very forward to Ooh, that. My head! My oh. head! <gasps> you now got the crown. Oh, hold up. <gasps> no! No! That was, that was exact... Exact... What? <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Will rattle me bones, right? Oh my god! <laughs> I don't believe it! Archduke of Prussia um, says the music is superb. The music is indeed incredible. Have you perhaps played uh, the PS4 game Medieval? Or even the original? Because if no! you really like this music, then yeah, that game Burger! is definitely something Sorry. you should play too. Well, now you know if you come back here, you can get that. You can also maybe restart the level. That might be worth something to ring. Uh, no, no, we can't just reset the no. level. We can't just do that. Come that's, back. 
I always get told off with whenever I reset a level because I miss something <laughs> by um, Liam. Zarek, oh, that is another game I have not yet played apart from the demo. Zarek, if you're going to play that game one day, I would recommend playing it in September because, you know, right before uh, October is the best time to play that game when it just gets a bit chillier after summer and it gets darker slowly. You know, have some purple lights on around you and play that game. It's just... I love it. Chef's Kiss. Other OG did a fantastic job with the remake. I got it. Snip, snip, snip. No! <laughs> I love that game so much that I bought it, and then I bought it again just for Liam, and I said, Liam, play this game. <laughs> right, okay, here we go, here we go. Oh, snip, 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 snip. I Get want a me medieval up. appear for to succeed. Oh, that's why the leaves are going brown because. Ah! Uh, uh, <laughs> no, 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 Well, Rose, one thing is for sure, we've definitely, um, listening to the buddies, we've definitely inspired some people in with Puppeteer. I've lost a head! Why did I lose a head? Because you got hit. Did I? Yeah, by one of the spikes. Oh. Um, is it like a, maybe a double jump you can do? No, i got to keep on snipping. There we go. I'm up, I'm up, I'm up, I'm up. Oh, Archduke, tell me about it. What, I would what, did, Arch, what did Archduke say? I would love to see Medieval 2 remade. Oh, uh, I mean, I still need to Kudrow properly... I've only played excited. the demo of Medieval 2. Of awesome we own it, but I've only played the demo. Yeah, it's another one of those games I'm, I'm deliberately Sam. keeping beside um, until Christmas. No, not Christmas. Uh, until Halloween happens again. Sir Daniel Fort is good. Hold up, Rose. I need to grab some... Uh, what is it? Something from the floor, quickly. Yeah. Uh, oh, just give me a sec. Uh, is it a, me a bit messy down there? In yeah. The just let. Give me a sec. Oh, hold up. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh, be careful of your headphones hitting the chair. <laughs> oh, Nick. Oh, I'm so stuck down here. Hold up. <laughs> I love the world of puppets. I think it's what very. What do you love about it? It's just very charming and magical, and it's lovely. Are, and these... are the people in the chat nice to you? The j people in the chat be very nice to me, Mr. Dog. You better be nice to Rosie, because. I... So be <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mr. Dog, how are you stairs. doing today, though? Just it's a bit dusty down you. here. Lee never cleans this room. Did you know that? Does he not? Why isn't your mouth moving anymore, Mr. Dog? It does. <laughs> <laughs> what are you on about? Why do you still have this this tag on your ear? Mr. Don't touch it! <laughs> it's my favorite earring. How dare it's you a touch it? It's a wonderful earring, Mr. Dog. Yes. Yeah. You like my hat? I love your hat. It's very festive, Mr. Dog. Hey, we it? need to bring it backwards. So can you show everyone your lovely Every holly? Holidays. Look at that lovely bit of holly on his head. No, I'm gonna have to go back again. See you, baby. Goodbye, Mr. Dog. Thank you for joining us. Oh, my us. goodness. What's going on down here? Are you all right here? down there, Nick? Oh, it's so dusty down here. Like, Liam never cleans his room. Did you know that? <laughs> never, ever, ever cleans never it. Never cleans it. Oh, hold up. Ah, there we go. There I am. Well, thank you for cleaning Liam's floor for us. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no worries. Oh, my God. This is like Sonic Hero stuff when you get all the rings. <laughs> Look at you go. Way up. Way up. <laughs> Above average, Andrew says, Mr. Dog is greater than Nelson. <laughs> what do you think, everyone? Is Mr. Dog, is he a good member of Buddy Games? <laughs> yeah, he, but he or has, you, a, he has you, a festive hat, though. You can only use him in the festive time. Oh, wait, does he only come out during the festive season? He only comes out in the festive season. You need to make, play more puppet games then, maybe. Maybe then he'll come out. <laughs> He only comes out. <laughs> At least oh. where's Mr. Ape? Do you remember that? 
who had a little ape escape monkey. Oh my god, Mr. Ape. How could we forget Mr. Ape? I bet I even gave Mr. Ape the same voice. <laughs> that was the best. Yeah, that was a good time. I, I love that little monkey that I found. Um, we found him in a gaming store, and I was actually Kudos. contemplating in getting it until you said, actually, no, Nico, you love it, you should get it. And then I was like, oh, okay, I'll just get it then. And then I didn't, in the end, and I now don't regret it. I'm glad you told me off by not, by not getting it. It's one Bats. of the, the kids. I'm a bat, I'm a bat, I'm a bat. Save the kid. Hang on, I'm a bat, I'm a bat. Embrace me in Batman. Do one of your tricks. I'm trying, I'm trying. Now you know the, the normal trick you do, yeah, that one. Take me, bats. I'm one of your fellow bats, or is this literally just like a cool little Maybe you need egg. to free the kid. Cut the bats, is what Mr. Kutucker says. Oh! Oh, that's <laughs> a bit grim, but it works, I guess. These poor bats! Do I need to get? What's the point of this? I'm, oh my god, I'm going up. You need I'm to going go up. up. You need to follow it. Oh. Oh, ying, 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 ying. Can you. Uh, I've already got a burger. That's okay then. What about those flowers in the back? Not I'm not sure there was a lot going on just then. Steins is a genocide of the paper bats. Um, ah, my gosh! Alf Daff once says, don't leave the kid well, behind. Uh, I don't know if you can, uh, like, the free the kid. Mightiest champions all fell. I love and this as a mechanic. I'm having so much fun. Now, where do you suppose the night Does it remind you a bit of the, the floatiness of a game like Loco Roco? Where you yeah. nice, like, flow around the game. Oh, did I free the child? I don't know oh, if you so can. Hang on. Was tight. The weaver I did. The oh, you're meant to interact, I think, with the children, with the, 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 the kids. Maybe, yeah, if you use Yin Yang. Yeah, Yin Yang. No, 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 no. But Mavis Andrews says Batman is crying somewhere after the bat incident. Save the save the kids in the back. Oh no! So many children I'm not saving. You'll get the bad ending. Our Shook says Rosie is going mad with scissors. Mad with scissors. Uh, spider. Oh, well, there goes the spider. I thought you first took so much pride in saving all the Mudokans, and now here you are. The crushed forces of the moon goddess were detained at his majesty's pleasure to starve, rot, and generally suffer. Whoa. Only their armor remains. To tell their terrible tale. Wow, that's that's grim. Did you hear what he said? No, what was he saying? That basically all the knights were left there to kind of like rot and suffer. Oh, and then man. their armor was just there to tell a terrible fate. Oh my gosh, sorry. Wait, this is so much fun. <laughs> Leno Graham says, hello, hello there. Hello! Welcome what? back to Buddy Games. Also, if there's anyone new to Buddy Games, hello, I'm Rosie and this is Nico. Yes, hello. We're uh, currently playing Puppeteer on PS3. Liam right now is off and uh, it's just the two of us that's playing. Although Liam is in the chat right now. He is the, the Buddy Games account. <laughs> he is the Buddy Games account. Okay, right. You can save them. Okay, right, 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 right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I am the chat today, says Buddy Games. <laughs> hello, I am chat today. Rosie be like, F them kids. <laughs> no, I didn't know you could save them! Gorging on the power in its lord's dark seal, a weaver. Oh, another boss? Oh, you've got a horse head now! Look My horse is amazing! Keep his head! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Looks like the horn has become a knight. He took it. Oh, it's up there! No! no. Uh, Little Graham says, how are you all? We're doing fine. Uh, this is the finale of, uh, of Buddy Games. Yeah, for so this year. This is our last stream uh, for this year. And uh, then next year we'll come back. Um, <laughs> other than that, yeah, we're super excited. Like, you're, all, you're already on your Christmas break? Yes, I am currently on my Christmas break! <laughs> on my Christmas break! Oh, no. And I'll be on my Christmas break tomorrow, so I'm super excited. Right, here we go, here we go. This is the ticket, this is the ticket. That's how we defeat him. 
That's right, Goldians. Love me for oh. Looks like you found Oh, here we go, here we go. I bet you can come through. <laughs> yeah. yeah! The power of scissors. <laughs> oh, I need another head. Okay, I got two burgers. Oof! No, no, head, head, come back. Ah, oh my goodness, ah, my goodness. Nico, you're gonna have to talk to the chat for me temporarily because I'm just making noises. Ah, ah. I'm avoiding the horseman. Do you love the weirdly tilted candle in the back? The weird, weirdly tilted candle? There. Oh my god, I love it. <laughs> oh, That's not <laughs> candle fat. That's not even how, like, candle fat works, anyway. <laughs> slip, 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 slip. Oh. Yes, I'm winning! Look at all the burgers I've got. I've got three burger heads. This game's like, wow. Oh! Ooh, nice! I got a trophy! 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 One step toward the... Leonard Graham says, are you all set for Christmas? Um, we need a couple more things for our roast on Boxing Day. Um, we'd like to get things before Boxing Day rather than on Boxing Day. Um, but other than that, yeah, we're pretty much set, aren't we? Yeah, we had to do a couple of, um, we're having the children this year as our original plan sadly got altered. Yeah. Um, but. Yeah, but what is it? We're still gonna make a, a good time out of yes. it. I hope you're, you're gonna have a good Christmas yeah, as well. Yeah, what are your plans for Christmas? If you celebrate Christmas, of course. Or well, yeah. your holiday season. Mm-hmm. Way up, way up, way up, way up, way up, way up. Oh. Sorry, way up. Slap. But yeah, it was, uh, what is it? Our Christmas specials was fantastic. You know, I, I really enjoyed it. I'm just saying that because I genuinely just enjoyed my time with it. Mm. It was so much work to set all up, but I'm so glad we did. Oh, what, the, the Secret Santas? Yeah. Yeah, no, they That's, were wonderful. It's a shame that because we're, now we're in like widescreen, we don't have the snow effect anymore. Oh, that's true. Yeah, maybe next year I'll, I'll make like an overlay that uh, does that or something in the body games. Oh, God, he's got really tall. There we go. Not tall enough. Not tall enough. Up with his head. Uh, Letogram says, heading, um, my heading to my brothers with my mum. Oh, that's nice. Oh, that'd be lovely. How do and Archduke says, I'm planning on spending time with my family. That's great. Uh, above average, Andrew says, uh, I just wrapped up my Christmas playthrough um, of The Last of Us and got the plat, so I'm off to a good start. Are you referring to the first Last of Us? Because um, if so, like, congratulations on getting the plat for that yeah, one. Yeah, congrats! Like, I won't lie, Rosie, but because <laughs> I'm going to have, like, lots of time to play video games, because what I like to do with my Christmas break is... I like to push everything like to the side and say like this is just a week. I'm just gonna sit down, yeah, and catch up with anything I wanted to play. Um, so I'm very in the mood to actually get a platinum. Like I plan for as if I have 400 hours, but I, I <laughs> but please, I only have like a week. <laughs> here we go. Here we go. I'm getting them now. I'm getting them now. <laughs> Natalie Money says, I'm currently doing a replay of Horizon Zero Dawn. Oh, Liam wonderful. will be pleased with that, uh, with that one. I still need to do the DLC. You've just reminded me. Oh, yeah, you still need to do that, yeah. Oh, did I not get him quick enough? <gasps> Come back. That's Rosie right. McLeod, hello, says, Hello. Um, I'm working a 7 to 2 shift on Christmas morning, but will enjoy the afternoon with my family. Rosie, salute to you for working on a, on a Christmas day. I, I hope you have fun at Christmas on, at work. I, I hope, obviously, that one day maybe that will change for you because, yeah, it sucks when you have to work on Christmas, but honestly, like, massive respect for doing that. Can't be easy, yeah. I can imagine. <laughs> Hang on. I've nearly got him. I nearly got him. <laughs> Do you like uh, this, audience? It's very satisfying to sniff, isn't it? It's so satisfying to sniff in this game. Uh, a lot of people are saying that you should play the DLC. It's very good, apparently. I've heard it's really good. 
Natalie Money says, I'm so hyped for Forbidden West. Zero Dawn is my one and all time favorite. Well, I hope that Forbidden West lives up to that. Because, uh, yeah, a lot of people are excited for that game. Oh, what's this? Iron Ball? Wow, this is cool. Hey, what does it do? Rose McLeod says, Boss, because I work in a care home. Oh, well, I'm, I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas day in, yeah. in the care home as well. I hope that everyone in the care home has a lovely day. Oh. Tiger! Quickly, you fool! He's going to find the night shield! How could he possibly know it was in there? Stop him! The Kukuro makes off with the shield! Oh, the sun princess! <laughs> and the tiger killed hundreds of people. <laughs> and then the tiger... And the tiger crushed hundreds of people in the theater. <laughs> With the help of Calibrus, Kuturo defeated the menace and saved the souls of a... The voice reminds me a little bit of um, well done, the, the voice from the a medieval game on PSP. It's the fourth now. doctor. Fourth... Uh, what, Tom Baker? Tom Baker. It reminds me a little Sorry, bit of Tom Baker. Sorry, I thought Baker. you meant like there was a character in Medieval called the it, Fourth Doctor. I was like, Ooh. It's not Tom Baker for sure, but it just reminds me a bit of it. Ah, Dan's Crypt. The best place where you'll find a, a dead, dead Dan. Dan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I do love that line. Tower. I've loved but that line since I was, was kid. His heels. Where were the knight's powers? <gasps> Who was this princess that had been locked up? <gasps> and would Kutaro make it out of the Black Castle alive? <gasps> or would he? Well, let's find... Oh, out. wait, the narrator oh. is the voice of the vacuum and it takes two... Wait, yeah. really? Yeah, I, know. I, I heard that, but it's just like such a tiny roll, right? I just don't remember, I don't remember the Remember when he sucked out his own eyes? Well, I say tiny roll, but it's only because it takes two has so much to give. Like, it's like out of one out of a hundred like memorable characters in that game. Such oh, a good so game. Oh, there. Oh, Souls Rescued 41 out of 49. Okay, right. So I Kutu. clearly knew when I first started playing and it's, then I forgot in this one. It's a shame one. that Bart Long hasn't like... Um, Let us continue our it, adventure. Uh, put a VOD on those streams because otherwise you could have like referred to... Uh, so the body games audience to those. Yeah. Yeah, because you did stream that he takes two with Bart Long. was defeated and her legion was put to rout. Her loyal subjects tried to resist. Four champions, ever faithful, rose to their mistress's cause. Over a period of weeks, they concocted an elaborate plan to lead a pathetically small but equally valiant army against the Moonbear King's castle, Grizzlestein. Did it work? Well... <laughs> Hooray! Archduke says, Medieval Resurrection is not as good as the original, but it still has its moments, and I have to agree, yeah. So it's a new character on screen, so I want to see him. They were hopelessly outnumbered, but so desperately did they fight, so bravely did they broil, that the tyrant himself finally deigned to confront them. No! No! You fight well, dare I say, skillfully, but alas... Are you scared? <laughs> that shield will not protect you from me! No! Oh my god, the moon bear was like, yeah, he he eating him moment. out. The moon bear king used his dark magic to lock the four champions' powers away, and all would be challenges to his throne were wiped from the face of the moon. No! Good evening, Kevy. Hello, Kevy. <laughs> this show is a today, special Kevin? one indeed. Hope you're well, Kevin. We have new headsets. We really like them, Kevin. Do you like them, Kevin? Does everyone in the audience... Very intimate, aren't they? They're very close to my mouse, Kevin. No, don't do that. It's me, Rosie. And I'm with me, Kizzy. That is me. We're having fun with our new 
Yeah, thank you so much, Kevin Scully, because I know you you put a, a couple of bits as, as well as subs our way um, for uh, for these headsets, because otherwise it would not have been possible. Carries the deepest. Oops, sorry. Couldn't keep my paws off. <laughs> snip, 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 snip around. But yes, hello, welcome to Buddy Back to Buddy Games, Kevin. We're currently playing Puppeteer. And it's myself and Nico today, and Liam yep. is behind the Buddy Games account. He is. Oh, look! look <laughs> the new heads! Head. Sorry, the new heads just crossed around. 200 gold. <laughs> oh, that was a fun street. Oh, even the, the witch has an outfit. Oh my god, she's in night armor. I only just saw. Yeah, she's in. Yeah. Oh, very good. I love that their helmet is too Next small and therefore has to rest on her on her nose, essentially. Okay, shortbread mouse, shut her ears open. Use that shield to protect yourself. <laughs> Flame Beacon, hello. And Flame Beacon says, I just finished watching That's episode three of the Christmas Maze. Hooray! Thank you so much for watching the Christmas really Maze. Enjoyed it. Yay, I'm thrilled you enjoyed it. Attack, great or small, just as long as you don't get smooshed in the Ooh. No, no, buddy games, you're not trapped. You had the choice between watching a movie or, or being in the chat, and you chose the chat. <laughs> oh my gosh, you gonna punch me? Boom! Take that witch! Whoa! Witch! I said Whoa. witch! Whoa! Some attacks can be turned against the attacker. That's, those, those are foul words coming out of your mouth, bro. Witch! Yeah. Wait up! Hang on! Is she gonna punch me again? Try pointing the shield upward. Good. Now point the shield downward. Moving on. So imagine we're in the audience and you just have watching this tutorial. I mean, it's good that it's actually like blended into the environment of the game. It's not like, you know, here's a box and it's like, this is how you do it. Like, you're pretty much what it's doing now, but like just that. And it's just, you know, like you go figure out how it works. Like you got presentation, voice acting. There's loads of like cool things going on whilst the tutorial is explaining itself. Sorry. You're not apologize. You're not forgiven. <laughs> the shield wears out if you yeah, Rose, use it I'm too much. Really so because we be got this sure thing over here. Lots of rest. Got it? <laughs> then get lost. <laughs> oh look, the witch conjured up an exit. How oh, sweet! Does we should work? hurry before her magic fizzles oh, out. Yeah, it's like it's like we we we're, we're echoey. Is it, is it echo? Oh no, it's echoey. Hold on. And now. You have to press the button down. And now you're <laughs> And now there we go. We're back to the so <laughs> Hello everyone. It, turn, it turns out, guys, that this uh, mixer over here has an, uh, an effects panel. So we can play around with that, uh, which is what I'm going to do right now. <laughs> Rosie, yes. you are in an echoey room. <sighs> what am I doing in the echoey room? It's so Rosie, echoey, Nico. <laughs> Where are we? Are. <laughs> ah, Nico, I lost my this head. This is Liam's living room. Very minimalistic. Very empty. Oh, I need to block. Hang on, that's what I need to do in the echoey room. Now I'm no longer in the echoey room. No, you're no longer in the echoey room. Did the filter work for me as well? Yes. Okay, good. That's good to know. Now they're in a cave. <laughs> now they're in a cave. Um, Flame Beacon says, did you guys get a new soundboard or something? No, so um, we had to get this um, well, mixer with, uh, with these headsets, which is where some of the money went to as well. And we can basically make our sound better, but as a bonus, it came with a couple of sound effects. So we can tinker around with that and add some extra sound effects to stuff, uh, which could be super useful for uh, for Liam if he wants to make a trailer uh, or something. Uh, Steinson 
I lied to the message. Said. The shimmering gateway so I assume swipe. this means the body games will be doing a radio Christmas play, ha huh? <laughs> A radio oh, Christmas play. Yeah, we could do a radio I Christmas heard. play if you'd the like to see us a radio Christmas play. The security system <laughs> was installed here last week. Right. Yeah, Archduke, yeah, we did some uh, some research on the... Um, Use the... What the is what it? Head? What, what we can get. Uh, and this was the, bu the best bang for our buck um, right now. And we hope as well this will give us a lot more like leverage for, for, for lurkers, for instance, because now the sound quality is nice and crisp, so it's probably nicer to listen to us, and therefore it creates a better stream. No, your voices are still coming through. No, it's still awful. No, your voices are still there and it's terrible. <laughs> Bonk. Come at me, What did you say about my voice? <laughs> that, that was a shocker. <laughs> what did you say about my voice? Did I sound like some like big entity? You sounded like a very big spooky entity. Right, have I still got the Fear me, Rosie? <laughs> it is I. <laughs> okay, Ooh. you go ahead, say something. Oh, hang on. Oh, oh. Ghouls! <laughs> ghouls! Uh let's try this head. Yeah, that one's like a lock or something. Use the lock head. You need to go. I had the... another head here that was like use the Viking head, which I, think I don't have. I need to have. come back to here, to here. Maybe, yeah. All right, then let's just progress. Woo! It is I, Buddy here, God, says Stein. <laughs> it's I am Buddy God. Play <laughs> vegan, so, so you're ahead you. in this game. Hey! <laughs> 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 Oop. Well, if we need a comedic writer, we know where oh, to God. look. Anybody oh, look, you see the tiger's eye. Yeah, the tiger's eye. There you are, you vicious bitch. Alright, just gonna destroy oh. the wall. <laughs> yeah, take that. <laughs> oh. Now, let tiger have it. oh my God, we just stabbed him in the hand. Let him have it, though. This is brutal. <laughs> Imagine if you had like a knife stab you in the hand. This game's not very different. We're in the paw of the hand. We've reached the top of the prison. They're yeah. very you don't the have princess. You're fine. Hey! You don't have to worry about that. Stop oh my oh, god, god, very Popeye-ish, isn't it? Popeye! me. Are we gonna start hitting an age where people don't know who Popeye is? Oh when was the gosh. last? When was the last time Popeye was like, um, what is it, um, like relevant in regard to media? When was the last thing Popeye-ish came out? Well, he's got a film coming, is hasn't he? No, no, that Watch got cancelled for, for uh, I believe, uh, the Emoji movie. Oh, what really? That yeah. looked really good, the Popeye film. Yeah, it looked really good, and then they said, yeah, let's count that for the Emoji movie instead. And Whoa! then Emoji Movie made a lot of money, and then they were like, great. <laughs> <laughs> we made the right decision. We made the right decision. Um, <laughs> Buddy Games said, a new Popeye game just came out! Buddy Games, we need to talk about this then. A Popeye game? Oh, Mr. Fuzzy goes to that garbage shovelware game. That's like, uh-oh. <laughs> Wait, what game is this? Uh, there's a new Popeye game. Uh, Archduke, oh Archduke, I'm gonna break your heart if you like Popeye is because um, the there is a trailer else? for it. That was like a pitch a fire um, for a Popeye movie, and it's really good. It's like just type something like Popeye movie Sony, you'll you'll definitely find the trailer. Um, and they initially went with it, and then they cancelled it uh, in trade for the Emoji movie. Yeah. Woo! Which is, let's be real, a bit of a an, uh, an, uh, an unfavorable decision. Sorry, I had a little, little... Yeah, Stein said, yeah, yeah, I feel you. I feel you in that one. What did Stein say? Uh, Stein says creative bankruptcy and a pile of cash over originality with less cash and more risks probably involved as well. Emojis are a guaranteed success. Who said that Popeye still could be a... Yeah, we, you know the drill. It's, yeah. But luckily, though, if you keep looking, you can find hidden gems like Wait, this game. Whoa, hold she's up. Lauren, Lauren. She's a lady. I haven't seen Lauren in a while. Hello, Lauren. 
Lauren! Hello, thank you Lauren. So for hosting! Yeah, thank you so much for the host. I hope, hope you had a lovely December so far. Going in the book of eternity! I just put Lauren Quinn because I've lost your name, I'm afraid. Oh, Mr. Futuko. Yeah, that's that. Oh, uh, mm, not really happy with that one. Uh. Oh, you need a mask over there. Did you see that? Yeah, that was like some sort of a ball head. But I don't have anything. I, I love the, the emotes as well. I mean, the, the, the animated emotes. What was difficult though is the I crown, the crown, the crown. I've got that. I've got the crown. I could really go for my own. Oh, don't, don't. You lose, no you lost the crown. Moaning, a hero never leaves a... <coughs> Wait, do I have to be the princess head? Maybe, but you definitely need to deflect the uh, the attacks. Found the head. Oh, maybe because I did that. Oh no, I need to recharge my shield. Okay, recharge shield, recharge shield. Yeah, so when you make like emotes, animated emotes for uh, for buddy games, no, for buddy games, for Twitch, because apparently you're only allowed to have 60 frames, which if you have a 60 frame animation means you can only have for one second. So there's a real challenge to find uh, a balance with them. Because I do feel that if you make them 60 frames, they look better. And that makes for, you know, emotes you're more likely to use. So it's a good challenge. Like a hero or something, right? Questing to save the princess? Why else would you have Calibreth and the Moon Knight's shield? Well, you're about three feet too short and three hours too late. But thanks. Like, seriously. I love that they, uh, rather than actual rain, you see like this little light effect. Because yeah. if you look at the plank of wood, you see that it, the, the animation just keeps going. You see it? Yeah. Yeah, it's just the light. Oh, oh. Oh my god, she got eaten! He's still going. <laughs> and he's gone. Okay. Okay. Time going to get to the big right age, your little friend, who you See have the same head as. The tiger is flashing. That's a piece of the moon stone. Without that bit of dental work, a brawl is surely brewing. A brawl is surely brewing. You're up. You're up. <laughs> right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Fight time, fight time. Oh yeah, my this, god! This I'm expecting a, uh, a uh, what is it? Uh, a Popeye situation where he's just stuck, where she's just stuck in the belly or something. No, uh, Pinocchio, sorry, Pinocchio, not Popeye. Steinson says, oh, Nico's trivia has enlightened me once again. <laughs> nice real theater effect there. Yeah, it, it just comes to show how much love these creators put in these guys. Okay, I got a jump and guard, jump and guard. Jump and guard, jump, jump and guard. guard, jump and guard. I love that though, that's a really good, like. That's pretty cool, yeah. He just, you know, just summons lightning into his palm. Now, ladies and gentlemen in the audience. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> he licks his ball. Did you see that? <laughs> oh, Kevin Scully. You're so right. I am mega excited for a Cuphead DLC. Oh, I'm uh, so unbelievably excited. I'm so stupid. So, it's called DLC Island, right? <laughs> and uh, they were singing about the delicious last course. And I was like, oh, it's very cool. But why would they call it something, you know, Cop outy as DLC Island, and then Roach said, "You do realize that it's called Delicious Last Course, right?" I was like, That's "Delicious okay. Last DL." <laughs> it felt so stupid. I was like, "Why did they make such a comment?" I was just too dumb to understand what was going on. <laughs> I was like, "You do, yeah, Delicious Last Course." Also, I, I lost the health because he ate me. I couldn't even get the head back. He just ate me. <laughs> uh, Flame Beacon says, anyone on the Axis team have a platinum for Cuphead? We hope that this one might get one one day. Yeah, Nico and I have been working. Yeah, we are working for it. Uh, yeah, so uh, I hope one day we can get it, right? It's going to take a while because it's a hard game. And we've been trying it a couple of times. But if Mark Cerny can, dang it, we can do it too. Right. Here we go. Okay, so square, and now it's X this time. Flame being says, "Good luck." 
Oh, we're going up into pause. We're going up into pause. I was going to clap as well. <laughs> oh, my. Oh. It's Look at the carpets, too. Oh, no. We've got a root canal treatment. Oh. Keep your filthy mitts off my fan. Okay. Okay, I've got a health back as well. That's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, what does this do? Elf Dav Wong says, when is Nintendo going to get a trophy system? I've got Cuphead and Hades on Switch. I mean, I would love for that too. I've already expressed on Twitter before that I'd like to see Nintendo do a similar thing. Um, it's just hoping that Nintendo maybe does that one day. Um, yeah, that's it. I don't know why they're not doing it. Probably because I also know that Nintendo really likes his focus on just making games. Uh, this is one of the reasons why, for instance, you don't Good see Netflix. Well, that's oh, oh, what's happening? Bart Long has raided us Bart with a party Long. of five. No. Hello, Bart Long. Hello, Bart Long. You've got me right in the middle of a boss battle right now. But actually Hello, meaning... you caught me. Hello. Is that I'm doing this? Are we doing this? No, you, like, I'm right in the middle of a boss battle at the moment. This is Puppeteer on the PlayStation 3, and it's a what I would consider a hidden gem. Nobody talks about this game. It came out very late on the PlayStation 3, and it looks great, it runs great, it's a very fun game to play, right, Rose? Incredibly creative, incredibly fun, and joyful. I'm having such a blast yeah. playing it. Absolute, like, big recommendation. Yeah! Right, here we go. Oh, oh, whoa! Jesper! Let me see if I got that right. Oh, oh, yes, oh, Jesper oh, resubscribed with a tier one sub, and they've been subscribing for five months. Thank you so much, Jesper. Thank you, Jesper. We're going to have to put you uh, in the book of eternity. I will put him in the book of attorneys for you. Uh, yes, bro. Thank you so much for supporting us because with people like you, we've been able to afford um, two new headsets, as you can see, as well as a mixer over here, which we can do lots of cool effects Hello. with. Hello. What am I supposed to do here? I don't know. And uh, yeah, we have now better sound quality because of people like you. So thank you so much. And you're going once again in the book of eternity. Okay, I think I have to cut his tongue, but I didn't. Oh, or did I? Oof. And there we go. Oof, oof, oof. Um, Kevin it looks great. An art style that, like this doesn't really age. Yeah, that's the thing, right? Like it's just so well made and it's so original. Um, like, there's a couple of games that do something similar, like Paper Mario. I've seen it definitely do before. Uh, gosh, I've, I've definitely played more games that play like a theater or break the fourth wall, but it's just so good. Did you put Jesper's name in the book of attempts? Yes. Sorry, thank you. Yes, because I've never even heard of it. It came, this game came out Ooh. right at the end of the PS3's life cycle, so Sony was hyping everyone up for the PlayStation 4. So this one kind of went under the radar because of it. Oh, 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 they killed the tiger. <laughs> Poor tiger, though. Look at him. Yeah, he got fully sliced to pieces. Poor thing. And he has a cool design, doesn't he? He does have a cool design. <laughs> yeah, we're kitty. gonna find the moonstone. Bring along Wait, us. what? That's his fang. That's yeah. one of his fangs. Yeah, it was part of the moonstone, <laughs> which is why we'll try to cut it off. Oh my word! You found one of the moonstone shards. Most impressive. I knew Arch, I picked a poor dogger. Poor dogger. I think we're ready to team up in earnest. But anyway, Bart and Jesper, I saw you were playing a game together. What was it you were playing? Yeah, what were you guys playing? Like, I gotta tell you, it's not like you're anybody special, am I right? Ooh. Even he felt that burn. It's the tyrant! Drive me alive! Give me back my scissors! I'll chase you to the end of the I think you have to play. No, I, I don't yet. They're breaking... Ooh. And with that, she crashed into hundreds of people in the theatre. <laughs> Along with the uh, the cat, the tiger, I mean. The ti they all crashed into hundreds. Bart Long says, bottom off, sleepy time, last day of work, and I have my holiday. We Woo! were here, uh, That that's the game we played. Oh, I haven't heard of that. I'm with you, Bart. Um, I have one day left as well, and then we're both off. So uh, get ready for some uh, pirating with Liam. With the because we are looking very forward to playing a bit of Sea of Thieves. Pirates. The Pirates. Pirates. But uh, yes, thank you very much for the raid and for joining us for a little bit and joining us in Puppeteer as well. Thank you, Bart. Hope you sleep well and have a wonderful last day. <laughs> yeah. We've done Act 1! That's it.
We're first doing... bit of the game. Wait, what Boom. time is it? I can't see from oh, here. Oh, yeah, you still have half an hour left. Yay! The picture would have been unlocked in the main menu. Join your favorite characters oh, on Untold Adventures. Could you show the, 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 the menus, the books and the, and the heads you can change? Because it's so cool as well. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Oh, wait, Bart's highlighted a message. So he's un unawareingly. <laughs> Good night, everyone. Have a wonderful holiday, everyone. Have a wonderful holiday, Rosie. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Dog. <laughs> <laughs> Roll oh. credits. Right, the head collection. Yeah. So another thing I really like about this game. Oh, yes, but also highlighted a message. <laughs> <laughs> we were playing. We were here. A escape like a game. Where we were. <laughs> An escape room like game. Escape room like game. <clears throat> you should look where at the camera, we were, Mr. Dog. Look at the camera. Where we were trapped. <laughs> In Castle Rock, and have to solve puzzles to escape. It's a little bit like Operation Tango. <laughs> do you do you go into a deep voice every time? It's a trademark title. No, when it's in quotations. <laughs> <laughs> Body Game says. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Why is Mr. Dog always looking at me? <laughs> because it gets the reaction out of you. Oh, anyway. Uh, yeah, where, where was I? Yeah, so this menu, okay? Glad we're over this. Liam, I know you have an infinite amount of points, so I'm not going to keep doing this. <laughs> um, yeah, so what's great is Kevin's... <laughs> <laughs> Kevin's got look at me, look at me. <laughs> Everyone's doing it now. Help me! This man has his hand up my bum! <laughs> Science and says... Hello, Mr. Dog, and I run this show. No, hello, I'm Mr. <laughs> Dog, and I run this show. Don't mind these two humans, they're stupid. Mr. <laughs> <laughs> says this was bound to happen. This was bound to happen. I'm gonna have another celebration. Is there any? <gasps> yes, there's a more teaser, teaser. Yeah. Merry Christmas. Oof. Right, yeah, so with the heads you collect, you can, like, you know... You can fit me your glass. Oh, yes. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> Thank you, Buddy Games. Buddy Games, we need hydrate. Ah. The music reminds me of Sly Cooper, says Archduke. Well, that's that's how you win Rosie's up hard We should over. do a Sly Cooper marathon on this channel. Oh. Liam should... Why don't you just do it on your channel, then? I should. Oh, Professor Juice. Yes, Professor Juice. Which is a tag that you can do down below here. Uh, Twitch.tv slash Professor Juice 2022, maybe? Who yes, knows? 2022 is the, is the goal. Is the goal, yeah. Uh, let's, let's test your camera out first because you've been so busy with the Christmas maze. Like, now now you can actually say that, right? Because you're always like, oh, I'm so busy, and it kind of comes off the cutoff, but now you're like, I've been busy with the Christmas maze. Yeah, so now, now yeah. I'm on my Christmas break. I do want to look into the camera, but I'm also taking a couple of days just... You know, playing Astro, but yeah. rescue mission at the moment. Playing Mass Effect 2, and I'm about to romance Garrus, um, <laughs> which I'm very proud of, because I'm like, yeah, Garrus. Um, and then, yeah, so just yeah. kind of like chilling at the moment. Yeah, so what I love about it, look, this is one of my favorite details about it. So normally with a video game, they can do something like you see on the right, which has like the back and you have the circle button over there. Um, but over here, I'll actually if you look at the left side, you see the thumbstick with the R, and it's like, oh, if you press left and right, you can move the stage, but it's like integrated within the design. And just honestly, for a PS3 game, this game looks so good mm. as well. Like now you can actually see the, the, the style for it, and it just, you know, it, like the light reflects off of it so nicely, and there's a wood texture over the whole thing, and it just moves dynamically, and it has no weird collisions either. It's just such a nice design game. Like, obviously, I, I I don't make the shots here, but I would love for this game to get remastered. Oh, yeah, same. Yeah. Like, it deserves to get more recognition and come to a platform like PS4 so that PS4 and PS5 users can play it too. God, there's so many... Oh, you got the hero oh, head. Oh, so you got... So, yeah, you got seven acts, it looks like, and then you've got yeah hero heads. And uh, also, there's another highlighted message oh. for Mr. Dog. <laughs> Hold up, let me... <laughs> Mr. Dog, wait there for a second. He's just like, oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I can do this. I can do this. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh. 
Harvard would, would would chuck chuck, would chuck chuck would. He would chuck, he would. He would chuck, he would as much as he could, and as as chuck as much would as a would chuck would. If a would chuck chuck would. There you go. His mouth wasn't moving. Why is he always looking this way? He should be looking at the audience. How much wood would a woodchuck chuck? If a woodchuck could chuck wood, he would chuck, he would. As much as he could, as much as as much as wood, as a woodchuck Nine would. Lives. If a woodchuck chuck wood. Cats, there you go. If a woodchuck could chuck wood, sorry. Have nine lives. Come on, Nico. Call the Jim Ryan and make it happen. Oh, I'll just, you know, call him. AKA is it, the black was it 079 slash dash welcoming, Jim Ryan? Hello, Not here's Nico. You know me from Buddy from Games. Buddy games. Shh, and I want this game to come to PS4. Esma Potts had a yeah, nice a story book after each act. With plenty of nooks, just the right size for a cat nap. Look at this, this is lovely. No better. I think I had a sloth for a pet. Said the witch, who was wise <laughs> enough to the cat. Buddy Games and Jim Ryan. <laughs> he remembered more exciting old days when he'd served the moon goddess instead. Oh, so this is learning a bit of a backstory about like Yin Yang. This, he purred, signaling a flashback on the next page. Oh, I won't go for all this now, but that's what I didn't know that was a feature, so. Oh, oh that's this wonderful. Game, this game. It just keep uh, getting uh, better. Above, above average, Andrew has a question for Mr. Dog. <laughs> <laughs> Who is Chuck? And why does he want wood? I don't know, Mr. Dog. Maybe you should ask Chuck. <laughs> uh, bonus stages? <laughs> I found one bonus stage. Getting there. Slow and steady wins the race. Right, act two, who to trust? After claiming the knight's power, Kutaro vanquished Tiger and escaped the Black Castle with the witch, Yin Yang, and Picarina. Picarina. Where would fate lead them next? Act two starts here. Oh. Pardon me. That thing is well, if I like hiccup and stuff now, you're gonna hear it all through the headset. So if I like do a burp, it's what I'm gonna go. Um. Archduke says a remake or remaster. Honestly, this game is is pretty much done. And I'd so say uh, a remaster. Continues. Bring the game up to 60 frames, 1080p, maybe 4K if possible. Um, yeah, and just call At it a day. Last, the day. This game is just his brilliant. Friend Picarina were free of Castle Griffelstein, born to safety by the witch's magic. Our fugitives. Maybe something with the touchpad because you have so that potential there. Castle Waxway. Oh, Futsuko. Yes. From which the moon 4K 60 on this. Yes, please. In those better days, the White Castle was resplendent. A sight to behold. But the tides of darkness had since dulled its sparkle <laughs> and loosened the stone of its walls and columns. Do -do -do -do. We're going to a new world. We're going to a new world. Oh. There, there, sweet. We'll just hide out here for a spell. But, like, this is Castle Waxway. Doesn't it belong to... The goddess? Yes, indeed. Although palace and master alike seem to have come apart. At the scene. Silence, Ying Yang! No one asked for your opinion! Out of the darkness and into the light, Kutaro had gone from Black Castle to White. This is more like it. No moon bear king spies and lackeys to follow our every move. <laughs> uh-huh. You've got a lot of gumption, you know that? Only one hiney should be warming that throne, and it doesn't have a wolf on it. Whoa. The moon goddess is gone, dandelion. I'm sure the palace is delighted to have such a promising new master. <laughs> promising? Try pompous. Try shutting up. <laughs> oh, my little earth and savior. Why you're nothing short of a hero. Come, be a good child and let me have a gander at that moonstone shard. Don't do it, Kataro. Calibrus, the moonstone, and the palace all belong to the you see that she was like this two blocks of wood and she was moving. No. Like a massive gap in her torso. Oh, 
Kutaro. Infinite Light has finally put me off the hook, bros, because it's your turn. Walking depression. He does that to Earth, children. And that's where the moonstone comes in. The source of all moonlight. After the moon bear queen shattered the stone, he gave the pieces to his generals. And you see how they shine. That's just one shot. Imagine the power I would have if you collected them all. I could easily spirit it go back home to Earth. Really mean it? It's in your best interest, too, my sweet. Didn't you say the Sun Princess was searching for the Moon Goddess? Yeah. Why? The Moonstone is a symbol of the Goddess's power. Restore Ooh. the stone, restore the Goddess. This could be your big chance. <laughs> you should start in the Moon. Now that overall is very medieval. Yeah, yeah that's very medieval, guess. You're going to get it back. I still don't trust you. You're using Kataro, and I am so going to prove it. You'll have to catch him first. Oops. Hey, Kataro! <laughs> and remember, you can tell a rat if you smell a rat. Go get him! Oh, kids! Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't speak over the cutscene because you know well, when you're watching when you're watching a performance, kids. And you don't go talk himself in a secluded That's disrespectful in the moon to the actors and actresses, a... kids. <laughs> and I can tell you that because I'm an actor. And kids. And storyteller. And storyteller, kids. Have you heard me tell you the story of the three little pigs, kids? It's a wonderful story, <laughs> which I can tell to you through someone who uploaded it on a YouTube video. It's on with, YouTube. Oh, hold up. Get with, it with the echo effect, he can he do like a ho. Ho! I think, kid, there's a better effect. There's more. We can get a better cave sound. Is it number three, maybe? Ho? Ho, kids? Yeah? Ho! Kids, here we go. Walking. <laughs> Taking the big stage in my kids. Now today, kids, in my little walking cave, I'm gonna give you a tour. To the right is some rocks. They help build my cave. <laughs> to the left, kids, we have more was rocks. What's that, Mr. Walker? Your your cave is getting smaller. Your cave is getting smaller, Mr. Oh, Walker. Oh, why are you destroying my cave, Nico Vleek? It's not very nice. Oh, hold up, hold up. There's there's a wall breaking, Mr. Walker. Yeah, there we go. What's happened, kid? <laughs> a wall broke. We're back in a big space now. Wow, oh, my cave has just expanded by like <laughs> five times. <laughs> I don't believe you've expanded my home, kids. I don't know why I now live in a cave, but I do. <laughs> and I'll tell you what. Oh, <laughs> I'm now, I don't live in my cave. <laughs> well, so, if I do this, and then I do this, we should have a very low voice. Well, we kind of sound, yeah. We sound like kind of aliens, but a bit more like. Hey. This is baby aliens, but then with a the lower. Aliens. No, it's not baby aliens, it's too deep for baby aliens. It's like baby. Is it, is it low? Hello, we're going to take over the world. Anyway, sorry, um. Infinite Light said, you've been quiet today, Rosie. No, it's just been because I've been playing the game and I've never played this before as well. So if I'm a bit quiet, it's because I'm focusing on the game and also we don't want to talk over the cutscenes because, you know, the theatre performances. <laughs> so I haven't been talking over the cutscenes. <laughs> and then the rest of it, I've just been, like, you know, just playing the game and chilling with you guys. I, was, I did the effects later on and I just started to phase it constantly. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, who's this? <laughs> Walken got evicted One from his cave. Walken <laughs> <laughs> got evicted. No! Is this an armadillo? Oh, a... a splash of purple later, and the choir Infinite Light says Resident Evil 4 anytime soon? Well, it depends how fast we grow, because I believe it's uh, 
on the 5,000 follower goal, we're going to do Resi 4. Once we do what, sorry? Once we hit 5,000 followers, we'll do it. Whoa! What's happened? Quick hatch! Hatch in the house! Quick hatch, you're going in the book of eternity! Quick hatch. Oh, and also we need to put Bart in the raid, so mm -hmm. Bart long. There we go. Oh, no, I feel bad though. Sorry if I've been quiet during the stream. I've just been really enjoying this no, game. I, I think Infinite Lab was referring to the fact that you um, that you were supposed to do a walking impression. Oh, it's like, oh no, you're quite rosy right now. Ow! Oh, you sneaky! Lano Graham says, I'm really enjoying the stream. Thank you so much for, for enjoying the stream. Um, yeah, thank you very much. Yeah, because we might want to continue. Was that the um, yeah, oh, it was. It I was, was just finishing my sentence Sorry. first. It's okay. Uh, because, yeah, we would love to stream this game more. Uh, Zarek says, Merry Christmas, Nico and Rosie. Oh, and Liam as well in the chat. Thank you so much. Thank and Merry you. Christmas Attention. to you too, Zarek. Attention. Thank you very much, Zarek. Merry Christmas to you too. For those wondering, attention is now oh, an animated emote. So uh, if you want to have our attention, you can also use that attention. one. Attention. Have we ever played Fishy Bashy with Liam? Uh, yeah, we did for our YouTube videos <laughs> on our YouTube again. channel. So, oh, uh, this one just slips Liam, could you type in exclamation mark YouTube citizens. quick? But these storms you might be still here. Oh, 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 oh God, I need to slip quick. I need to slip quick. I need to slip, 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 <laughs> slip. There we go. Oh, Thank no, you. My head. Yeah, if you go to our YouTube channel, you will find uh, Liam and I have been playing, um, what is it, Bishy Bashy in the past. Um, Alf Dab 1 has redeemed a crash by any good noise. Give me a character, Rose, and I'll just do a voice. A time, there was a uh, hang on, I feel like I should do one now. Because you've done a lot of crash by the good noise. Can you do uh, Cortex when he does his taunt in Crash Bash? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, add Echo, add the Echo, add the Echo. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh, no. Uh, this one. Ready? Bandicoot. <laughs> yes, that's how we should be using this. We have the power. <laughs> we have the glory. See, you got even a bonus, Liam, going. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, is that secret? Which way's the secret? Which way's the real way? Good question. I said. Oh yeah, it's indeed. Maybe just take a left first and Holy see what happens. It looks like that no, I think that's the way we're going to have to go. Oh. Yeah, I think both of them are the same way. Yeah, let me they try. They both just lead to the same thing. Oh, no, they don't. They don't. What? what? Oh. What's going on? Oh, maybe they do both lead to the same way. I think they do. There might be like a secret somewhere in between. I really love this snipping mechanic. Whee! Can you imagine if the, if it was on a PS4 and you have the, obviously you have the little speaker and you control it and imagine if it every time you, uh, you you snip 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 a coin of boring streamer <laughs> buddy game Liam said wow that's my panda. crash noise that's what's that over there Rose <gasps> it's a panda honey <laughs> it's a panda she gets very soppy when she sees pandas but you better not come attacking have you, me. Have you told the chat about your uh, your your new um, my panda slippers? Yeah. Oh no, the baby flung off the bamboo. <laughs> oh yay! Where's my she panda? Get, like I said, she gets very soppy when there's pandas. Where's the my panda? She um she got panda slippers from me. I I bought some panda slippers. There yeah, he is. And then it, there he is. And then immediately they both got holes in them, so I had to stitch them up. <laughs> yeah. Oh wait, let's let's free you've this. You've got such hobbit feet, right? It's not my hobbit feet. <laughs> I lost the head. <laughs> oh, the Insomniac says imagine dual sense haptic for the snipping. That could be quite good as well. Oh, that'd be Depending nice. Depending on like what kind of fabric you cut through, it's like you know it's thicker to cut through. That could be interesting. Thank you, Mr. Pandas. Did the panda help you out? I like to think that the panda helped me. Look at him, he's so lovely. 
You're like, thank you, panda, and the panda is like, no worries. Another queen of Bori. Whoa, hang on, hang on, hang on. What's all this with the bamboo? What's all this with the bamboo? The old bamboo, the old bamboo. Everything is better with the old bamboo. Deppy dime, deppy dime, deppy dime, deppy dime. Never need a reason, never need a rhyme. You need a deppy dime. What's that hook? Can I do something with that? What's that? Aren't you in a hurry? Oh, is that a head? You think that's a hint? That little hook there? No, I, I interacted it with it and then it popped up, I think, oh, a head. Oh, you can pull it. You can pull it. Look, if you if you uh, use the, the, the... Oh, it looked uh, like it's at the... Well, yeah, the a head was... popped out of it, and it, but, but I wasn't uh, down there to catch it. It like, appeared and it went down there. It's already gone then, yeah. <laughs> you think you can get a panda head here? <gasps> oh, that was, that was a kid once. Remember? Now he's a part of nature. <laughs> oh dear. The poor child. Kids and Goldie so Ants. The big panda! You can get a panda head. Oh, can't get... oh my god, I have a panda head. Need... No! This isn't a panda head! I didn't want this! I How to... are you gonna get a panda head? I wanted to be a Look panda. Look how sad the panda is. You, that uh, could have been your friend. He's eating bamboo. He could have been your friend that day. Oh, I want the panda! Rats purple goo had already found out the moon was pristine. <laughs> this is sad panda. Do you think the panda would like a crown? Into ferocious demon no, fish. Who took this is an ADHD's completion his nightmare. Hey, you don't suppose <laughs> the rat is hiding out up river at the top of the waterfall? Wait, is that why Rosie's adventurous driver Nico, the hobbit feet, I mean? What? Is that why Rosie is an adventurous driver? I'm wait, am I an adventurous driver? No, you didn't not drive that much. If anything, you drive like the least out of anyone that I know. But I've got nowhere to go during a pandemic! <laughs> I don't no, 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 forget no, that when the pandemic that's hit. That's not an insult, Rosie. You do realize that, right? Oh, okay. Okay, you kind of took it the wrong way. Hey! Oh. Yeah, I don't forget that when the pandemic hit and it's... Whoa! Ooh, Nickpot98 has followed Buddy Games. Thank you so much for the follow, Thank Nickpot. you and welcome to and Buddy welcome Games. welcome to Buddy Games. We're doing our finale stream of, uh, of Buddy Games with uh, the Christmas streams. So if you haven't channeled in, uh, we got in our vault down below, we have um, three other episodes we've done. One on Harry Potter, one on The Phantom Menace, and one on Ape Escape, and they're really fun. Uh, we had a lot of fun creating them. So once the stream ends, we can definitely recommend you that stuff. And hopefully all of our work, if you fancy yeah. a little browse. <laughs> Liam said, Rosie, you drove to Scotland like two days ago, just for fun. <laughs> now, I'd like to drive to Scotland one day, though. Holy cascade! I just love to visit really Scotland. Look, once again, they're trying to create this, like, water effects by putting the lights over them. See what I mean? Oh, if you look, oh, look at the bridge, you can there, see it. There are piranhas. Fish. Fish! I'm not looking down. In fact, even... The water feels like it's a wrap of paper scro is it scrolling through constantly. Mm. <laughs> I missed something down there. I don't know what it was. Is it worth getting? Souls! Save them! Save the souls of the children! Liam, Liam, you, n you and I both know that Rosie wouldn't be the one driving. Ah, it would ah. be you because we wouldn't be asking you a favor. Get with it, Liam! Liam, drive to Scotland, please. Don't drive to Scotland! Can't be bothered to drive that long. <laughs> now, I have got better at driving since I've been driving a lot more recently. <laughs> no, it's not that, but we have, we have asked Liam for a lot of favours in the past. When we just moved in, we needed. Well, it's maybe uh, because I've, I've got a very little. I've got a very small car, so that's the problem, is. Yeah. It's like... And Liam's got a big car. Yeah, Liam has a big car. I have little. But I love my little car. Flying fish! Big fish! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Liam's got a limo. Yeah, that is yeah, 100% fact. Yeah. Liam will be the first person oh. to have a limousine and a Patreon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, God, Liam. Wow. Your limo not enough? It's almost like pink snow. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> I left it. Oh, let me guess. I already drove a V8. <laughs> you can get a, a 
one, a hat like this. Yeah. God, where are you supposed to get these hats from? I have to figure I, it I, out. I think we're doing something wrong, yeah. I think there's like puzzles we're not solving. Check out the cherry tree. And it's in full Oh, if, interesting question, Infinite uh, Light 81. Um, it's very, like, I don't know if you're familiar with, like, the process of, like, setting up a stream versus um, creating a YouTube video. But um, they're very typical for us. So, with a YouTube video, it's very easy to record it. The only problem is, is that uh, we don't have a live audience to respond to. So, we have to kind of, you know, have more material ready before we start. Um, and um, there's a lot of extra work that comes after it. Like, indeed, like, someone needs to edit it. Someone needs to sometimes even, like, can an episode because something goes wrong with it. Like, maybe the audio. Then we need to set it up on, on YouTube's algorithm to see if that works well. So there's a lot of work after it. Um, but the editing process is the one that takes up all the time. Whereas with streaming, we don't have that problem because we don't really have to edit it down. We like to do more editing in the future, but it just takes so much time that we sadly just don't have. However, um, setting up a stream takes way more time that actually streaming. We streamed apparently for 60 hours, but I'm pretty sure that for every two hours that we put uh, every week into a stream, we have definitely collectively put an extra three hours in just setting everything up. Because we like to make like thumbnails for it and go back to our videos and quickly change things around on our VODs. Liam uploads the VODs to YouTube, which takes a bit of time. So in regards of ex work, it's less. But and we can pump up more, but there's still a whole lot of work behind the scenes that need to be done. So for us right now, it worked quite well actually because we were able to produce quicker um, rather than having to like you know make a video and then upload that one. Not only that as well, but it's a lot more fun like to chill with you guys live as well. And you yeah. know, we're talking, we're grooving, we have a yeah. good time. Yeah, it's one of my favorite things about Twitch is that you get to interact with your audience, whereas with YouTube, you can only really do that either on Discord or in your, uh, was it, or in the comment section or Twitter. Um, I feel like you're losing that bond when you go on all the platforms. Uh, we fixed the cherry tree! Even though Light says your guys are doing such a great job with the YouTube and Twitch, thank you so much because we do we do put a lot of effort we do put a lot of effort into it. Yeah, Liam right now is managing a lot of the the vault stuff on YouTube, um, and I'm right now I'm usually just doing the art stuff right now. So making the thumbnails, making sure that the the titles look right, making sure that the um, what is it? Uh, the tweets are nicely dressed up and then we have material for that. Um, but yeah, we do try to put as much effort into buddy games that we realistically can in the hopes that maybe one day when we do get, you know, financially more support that we can then maybe decide to do even more for it. But we're just not in that stage yet and we're not asking anyone to get us to that stage right now. We're just wanting to like naturally grow, see where it goes. See where Excuses you got everyone with like one million followers. Yeah, exactly. I'm not saying like please, by the end of please, next everyone, year. tear free subs or go home, right? I'm not saying that. I'm not saying like everyone should start paying. What I am saying is that if it does get to a point where it gets more financially feasible, then yes, we'd love that. But for now, we're, we're very happy with where we are, I'd say. We just got a headset. We can't complain. We're really happy with you guys. <laughs> so I've just got some powers of a ninja. <laughs> I'm secretly waiting until Liam goes like, Oi, I do this as well. <laughs> Wait, what can I do? <gasps> Boom! Got... Boom! Boom! Yeah, Liam specifically, yeah. He, he's, he's always like, oh, I'm so happy. We're doing so well. It's so nice to work, do buddy game stuff. Just a little brighter. Yeah, I threw one in it. That would have light the light it up. Finally we can have some light in. Wait! Now it's too bright! <laughs> Blast it! <laughs> you can see all my warts! <laughs> yeah. Aim for that. Zarek said if this wasn't for classic gamer, I would have not found you guys. 
But yeah, we're very grateful for Classic Gamer, and he has definitely done a lot for Buddy Games. He's been, he's been a long-time veteran. Yeah, he has um, been. Liam believes, because I, I wasn't there at the time, so I can't tell you with uh, certainty, but Liam believes he's one of probably like the first 50 subscribers that Liam had for Buddy Games on his channel. that, but he's been with the YouTube channel for years. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, one of the first 50 subs Oh, sorry, YouTube. I thought you meant like he's in Twitch subscribers. No, no, no. Yeah, he definitely is, but... He's also one of the first 50 on, on YouTube, yeah. yeah. Oh my Whoa, god! Crimson! Woo, Crimson! Look, I, I know I just talked about like our dreams and whatsoever, but that doesn't mean you have... The, oh, that's so nice of you. Oh my god, Crimson, thank you! Yeah. That is so... Oh, I don't know what to say. Oh my god, thank you so much, Crimson! And also, I don't think yeah. I've seen your name pop up, but welcome to Buddy Games if you've been lurking or yeah, if you have been chatting with me. Yeah! Oh, yeah, you're gonna hear that a couple of times now. Da, 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 da. <laughs> Crimson says, support and love, you got this, all of you. Thank oh, you so thank much. You, Crimson. You know, the, I hope the more that we get, obviously, the more we can give yeah. back, because we love doing this. Spushbook's <laughs> also got a sub. Everyone, can can everyone just spam whatever? Like, it's, it's Christmas is around the corner. Everyone just spam Santa whatever Santa Mr. Emotes. X's. Oh, God, we're going to get Santa Mr. Santa X's. Santa Mr. X's. Yeah. We're going to get Santa Mr. X's now. Santa in the Mr. X. Classic Gamer there in the chat. Oh, no. Oh, no. Hello, Classic Gamer. Um, do you know which, like, it's a very old, probably a very old for you by now, but do you remember at what point that you subbed towards uh, Buddy Games on YouTube? Just to get the truth out, right? Look at that. King oh, McEwen. King McEwen has hosted us. Thank you. You're Thank going you so in the book of eternity. eternity. Boom. You and squeaking at the that, that reminds me, by the way, Classic Gamer is not just a guy that views us. He's corrupted. actually also a streamer. Did yes, you know that? Yes, he is also a streamer. Liam, uh, could you put um, Classic Gamer's Twitch channel in the Please description? Please do. Yeah, because he also does his own streams. He does a lot of Fall Guys in Jack... I believe still do Jackbox, but he does a lot of uh, Fall Guys. So he's definitely also worth checking out. He's really good at Fall Guys as well. Remember when we played against him? On Bartlong stream. Was I there for that one? I think no, I think you weren't there actually, but Liam and I remember. I think that was on the job. one that I sadly missed. Oh I cut through the clouds to reach the stone mm. above. Classic gamer, I'll see if I can do it quickly. And so Kutaro snipped the ghastly lantern down to side and returned the shrine to normal. I do like doing the, the little downwards go. taunt. Yeah, he streams a couple of times a week, so please check him out as well. Zarek said, yeah, Classic stopped me from winning <laughs> but on Fall Guys in Bart's stream. Classic, that's not very nice. <laughs> you know, I'm sad I missed that stream. It would have been awesome to have played with um, some of you guys in the audience. It was a great stream, yeah. We'll ask Bart to do it again. Ow. Is it weird that this, this boss gives you a bit of Crash Bandicoot 1 vibes? Of a boss. Like very minimal, but also at the same time you feel very minimal in your options of what you can do. Yeah. Right, 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 right. Donk. Oh, by the way, chat, just so you know, but Liam's dad is apparently Santa Claus, remember? Yeah, Liam's dad is Santa. The Liam's dad is Santa. We have photographic evidence to support that Liam's Ooh. dad is indeed Santa Claus. Right, down that one goes. Oh. <laughs> Steinson says, wait, did Rossi Nico break into your apartment to stream? Uh, yeah, we kind of did. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. <laughs> Liam broke into our place to stream. <laughs> Funny games. Yeah, they smashed the door open. <laughs> no, he smashed our door. <laughs> Unless like it was the dog. Yeah, it was Phoebe, wasn't it, Liam? It was Liam? Phoebe. Phoebe let us in. Liam, are you with Phoebe now as well? I bet he is, actually. It, <laughs> it would make sense. Stein said the stream is incriminating no. evidence. Are no, you, Liam's uh, in the other room. Uh, Liam, is, uh, what is, are you with your, your dad's dog, the pug? Are you with him again? His enemies and can we can we get a picture the of the pug in, uh, was it in our Discord? That would be great. 
I was lost seeing that dog. You love Liam's dad's dogs? Yes. Bart has great dogs as well, did you know that? They're not like not actually he does, but his his mother does. What am I supposed to do? Uh -huh. But yeah, his dogs are just great. Bonk! Whoa, you seen a <laughs> up you or up yours. That was uh Yakisoba down there, by the way. Ah, uh, I want to try some yakisoba. I believe that's what it said. Wheeler poo. Oh yes. It says heavy soba. Not sure what that is. I have three bat heads. Wiener poo. Oh wow! I got lots of moon shards there. Hello, give me some of your powers nice, and you. The nice only uh, taiko drums over there. Sorry, I ruined your cooking. Oh my god, I set that soul on fire! <laughs> Liam highlighted a message, Nico. Oh, oh dear, sorry. Yeah, sorry, I was a bit daydreaming. Uh, and now, it's time for a fire scene. No! The puppet Look dog! Look at the camera! Not crazy! To dog! There we go. I'm the ultimate dog! She might have noticed, Chad, I'm, I'm one of those people that speaks first and then thinks next. Like, I improvise every time I speak, and for, when I read something out, I just read it and I don't think about how it, I articulate it. So sorry, but that sounded a bit clumsy. <laughs> Did you see him go like... Boom! Uh, roll it up and bonk! Oh god, I need to snip, 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 snip up the clouds! Snip up the clouds, I'm going up and up and up! Did you also see the, the heartless kids in the background? Oh my god, he hit teeth! <laughs> they were all crushed. But there's like kids in the background doing the drums. Oh, I can free them probably. Crimson has to redeem their hydrate. Oh, we need to hydrate! What a fight it was! Oh as no! Dodged my head! Oh no! Death and left from Tycho to Tycho. Oh no! No! Quick! You gotta jump away before you get I did! I jumped! I jumped! I'm struggling, miss! Ooh, that was close. I need to get over to that one. Oh my god, I'm like, you're like, do you feel it? There are some, like, you know, there are some feisty platforming challenges in this game. I really like it. Uh, yes, the bomb. Bonk. Right, I'll hydrate soon, I promise. <laughs> Mom, I will have a drink soon. I'm just playing my video game. <laughs> this reminds me of the final boss of Medieval 2. I'll keep that oh, in mind no, once, I've actually, once I've actually played it. Because Medieval 2 is definitely a game that I still need to play, but I, I played like the first... Daniel Fortescue. We played the first hour. really enjoyed it. Almost there, Kataro. He may look tough, but I can see the fear in his eyes. Yeah, great. I can see the... Have you seen the fear and the fire below us, miss? Bam! Bam! <laughs> oh, that was an easy one. Yeah, I got that one. I smashed that one. Bonk! In his chops! In his chops! <laughs> Up the clouds we go! In his chops! In his chops! Up the clouds I go! In, in his, his chops. chops! In his chops! Up the clouds you go! Oh, give me the snippet! 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 Snip. Oh, it's mine. That reminds me of a, a Rosie and Jim moment where they go to shave some sheep and they just go snippity snippity snip and then Jim goes bam. Steinson says they really nicely combined Victorian English aesthetic as long, uh, along with feudal Japanese. Yeah, they really oh, did. It's back. Uh, yeah. Here we go again. Make sure you free all there's like, the like time, okay? subtle elements of it as well. Like the, uh, not only do you have the taiko drums, you also have the when that the, the the evil guy went up, you heard like this bang, 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 noise. And that's the what is it? An instrument called the kota, which is a um, an instrument that is kind of like a guitar, but it's not fine tuned. But you have like these tiny little bridges um, that you put underneath the string, and you have to constantly just so like adjust the the kota in order to play it. And then you lay it down, and then you kind of like just roll your fingers along the strings like that and that's why you get like that well, 
Okay, now I can hydrate. And the souls of the children it held captive. Yeah, you're a Taiko drum! I'm a Taiko drum! Yeah! Oh my god, that's great. I'd love to one day hit a Taiko drum. You would love to wear a kimono one day. I would love to wear a kimono. On one of our trips to Japan. Oh, he's in bed. Oh, my sisters. Yes, I don't want to go back to me. <sighs> So the voice reminds me of Richard E. Grant in Sackboy Big Adventure. It did, but I didn't want to say it. But I'm pretty sure it's probably uh, not uh, Richard E. Uh, Grant. Uh, 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 <laughs> Kevin Scully says, I think we need a Nico. Oh back my god, he's put the tiger at the bottom of his bed! Okay, no, did you see that? that He's a bear. Okay. And what does he sleep with? A, a teddy bear. A teddy bear. <laughs> Kevin Scully, I'll keep it in mind. Uh, that might be a fun one to have. Look at you slap the tiger. Hmm. My god, that's brutal. Conspiracy. They steal calibers. They escape my castle. Now they conveniently find the moonwood. Do you think someone else is pulling the strings? Right. Keep a close eye on them. I shall take matters into my own claws. Bath time with Moonlight Bear. Never fear. <laughs> he has a little, like, you just need to jiggle belly and going on. What you do, you can tear them into tiny and threatening little bats. I <laughs> <laughs> just gave his reflection the teddy bear. Put toxin production on hold. Kuturo has been spotted in the moonwood. Then the rat has failed in his task. Snake, we saw a snake on the tie the, the, the tower. Word, sire, and I will strike your enemies down. Very well. Crash the life out of Kuturo, no matter the cost, and you will be well rewarded. The reward is in the crushing. We ate it. Watch as I devour all that stands in my path. <laughs> Elaine says, bet time for me. Happy Christmas, everyone. See you next time. Have Elaine. a wonderful Christmas, Elaine. Have a wonderful Christmas, and thank you all. Thank you so much for supporting us through 2021. I know yes. you've done a whole lot for Buddy Games from the beginning, so thank you so much for supporting us. You're a gem. With thank the help you. Of and I hope you have a wonderful Christmas as well. You've been a wonderful audience. Thank you, Ed. Oh, oh, Ed! You should have. You should have. Well Thank you so and much. And before you go, you go in the... Yeah, you're, you're guaranteed in the Book of Eternity. So if you happen to watch the vault, um, at some point, you will be shouted out by then. Um, LA 11. Uh, Classic Gamer says this is such a fun game to watch. And it, it is, yeah, absolutely. I, I just hate hate to regret to say but that this game is going up in price. I think the moon Don't quote me on this, but it might be literally home to on, on PlayStation Store. Newly Maybe. I don't know. Yeah. But if it is, then it will probably Kuturo stay in one price. Because I think this game sadly will go up in a quite high price eventually. Crimsa also said, uh, love the Mr. X emote and said, a new emote. <laughs> the love and care you put into your content, I adore it. And then it's been having Good. fun with our emotes. Thank you so much, Crimsa. Oh my God. Well, I was going to say, it's 10, it's gone oh 10 o'clock. it is. Ha. No way. We put, we streamed over two hours. Um, so we answer one question before we head off. Yeah, should, we, should says, we go into, into widescreen mode? Yeah, sure. We can do that. Uh... And the money say sure widescreen. I, yeah. <laughs> I mean webcam. This one. No, this one. <laughs> <laughs> Did it. Nico's behind the buttons today, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Lena's felt like, oh my god, I work with amateurs. Amateurs. But yeah, um, even at like 81 says, what games are you most looking forward to in 2022? Elden Ring! Elden Ring is probably the big one. Elden yeah. Ring! <laughs> yeah. I'm so looking forward to Elden Ring. But apart from that, like. Yeah. I mean, I'll let you go first because I've got uh, loads. What about Strangers to Paradise? Yep. Yeah. Chaos. I'm looking very forward to We're that. We're looking game. forward to having fun with that. Oh my god, it's going to be so fun. Looking forward to killing <laughs> Chaos. Um, yeah. Horizon Forbidden West. Yeah. Um, oh my goodness. Uh, I'm having a blank as to what's coming out. Uh, I hope that Ghost. We see more of Ghostwire. That might be nice. Uh, mm hmm. Yeah. Uh, well. 
Is the God of War coming out next year? Ragnarok? Yeah. I is it confirmed? I can't remember what I the don't trailer think said. It is. Yeah. I think the trailer said 2022. Yeah, because I don't, I don't want to put words in anyone's mouth. Uh, but yeah, I, I'm looking forward to that game. If it comes out well, in 2022. Yeah, I'm looking forward to Ragnarok. If it comes out in 2022, I'm looking forward I'm to that. I'm trying to remember what the, what the, the, t t the trailer said now. But yeah. either way. Yeah, that, uh, there's also... Oh my god, I feel like there's loads of them. I'm just having a blank. When was the next Marvel Spider-Man? Oh, uh, that's 2023. 2023. That's gonna okay. take a while, yeah. That's 2023. Uh, oh, Stray. I don't. Is Stray been confirmed for 2022? I I'm, don't know when it's confirmed. Yeah. A lot of these. Yeah, a lot of these. I'm not sure when if the uh, Destroy All Humans 2. I forgot about that one. Seafood's but... coming out in Feb. Seafood, yeah, seafood. I'm actually, I really want to try seafood. Yeah. That looks like a lot of fun. There was a game coming out in the end of Feb that I'm looking forward to, but I forgot which one it was. Like, like I said, I always make things up on the spot. Like, I'm very bad with like my memory. Uh, oh, Liam said Lego Star Wars: The Complete Saga. Yes. Yeah. Yes, that would be a great Full game. Forspoken well. says Kid uh, Zero Eighty. Mm -hmm. Forspoken. That looks really cool. Yeah. I hope that you know it's not confirmed for 2022. But if it does come out, I would love to see more from Final Fantasy 16. Oh, I just want more news on that. Yeah. I'm just like, more news, more news. Or, you know, part two remake might also be nice, but who knows? <laughs> uh, oh, Stein says Dying Light 2. That's very, has that been confirmed yeah. for 2022 as well? I can't, let's say 2022 and beyond. Yeah, for me, it's just like, I, I don't really look at, like, obviously, if there's something that grabs me, I'm always excited, but when it comes down to, like, games, I just play whatever I want to play. Like, mm. I, last year, I played a lot of uh, Squaresoft games that we didn't get, like uh, Parasite Eve, for instance, or in Brave Fence and Musashi, two games that came out in America. Yeah. Uh, really enjoyed those. Uh, so, yeah, for me, it's, like, it's all over the place. Uh, Classic Gamer says, uh, we could play together co-op. We would be fantastic. Oh, talking about... Um, Rayman. <laughs> oh, Rayman. <laughs> oh my god. Um, but yeah. Um, what is it? Those are kind of like the games I'm looking forward to. Mainly for me though, Elden Ring. Like, yeah. you know, Elden Ring. I'm just super, super excited for. Like, I, I like. I usually play like after I've done one from software game. I'll take a little break and then I'll play the next one. Oh, but Bayonetta I've, three, good shout. Oh, yeah. Bayonetta three, but I've been purposefully leaving this gap a bit extra long because I didn't want to dive into Sekiro, get used to that combat style, then go straight into Elden Ring and then, like, yeah, like be I like the bit then be like. Oh, it's not like, it's not, basically yeah, I'm saving myself for Elden Ring. Yeah, and not only that, but you've been, um, I believe you just came off of, um, the, the, you basically, you've had a, a long train of, of Souls games. It just happened to be like, first you did the Bloodborne, then you finished all the DLC, then you helped Bart out, then you went back to Demon Souls, yeah. then you ha helped everyone out of access, and you were like, guys, I need to take a little break. From Souls games because I'm I've had played a lot of it, so I know I don't want to come in fresh, refreshed, and then just jump in and enjoy it rather than be like oh, another Souls game. Yeah, yeah. I thought as well. Um, Dead Space. Don't know when that's coming oh, out, but yes, please. Dead Space. Yes, I'm saving please. my saving my PS2 experience for that. Earth Defense Force Six. I, we actually have 5.1 at home. Uh, oh. Should probably pick that one up. We have a highlighted message. It's my time to shake. You might call it a soul train. <laughs> soul train. I love how Mr. Dog sounds like the voice I give my mum. <laughs> oh, over. game over. Classic Gamer says, uh, there we go. Also hope everyone in the buddy community has a lovely Christmas, a happy holiday and a happy new year. Thanks for making this year a bright spark in what has been a tough time for lots of people. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas! I love how you do so many of these behind Liam and mine's back. I forgot back. to make that! I made oh them doing the little God. nightmare stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and also, thank you, Kevin Scully. We thank should probably you, start Scully. doing like Christmas messages. Cause yeah, we should. Yeah. Oh, should we do the Book of Eternity first? Have you put Kevin Scully in there yes. as well? Yes. So Great. let's do the the Book of Eternity. So, 
in the book of eternity. The last one for 2021. Yes, I haven't put the date on it yet. That's true. So I need to do that. I'll do that after stream. So for <laughs> subs, <laughs> Andrew put that with wings on the Oh Everyone my audience, god! Thank you and good night. Steins, no way. Thank you so much. Steins says, "Have a merry cherry Christmas." Thanks for a fun stream and a jolly good 2021. Steins, thank you so much for helping to support us, but also helping for support Bart Long. I know you've been in his chats a lot as well, and he's a good friend of mine, so he definitely appreciates you sticking around in his chats as well. So thank you so much for that as well. But before our Christmas messages, we have got, we had subs today from Jesper and from Crimsar. Thank you so much for yeah. the gift subs and resubbing. Bits, we had Harpo Speaks, Heinrich, Stein, Zarek, uh, not, sorry, my handwriting says Zanaru too. <laughs> <laughs> Air Lane Classic Gamer Kevin Scully, thank you so much. Thank you for Lauren Quinn, Quick Hatch, and King McEwen for the hosts. And we were raided by Bart Long. Thank you so much for your support, guys. Yeah. You are in the book of eternity. The last page. What of, is the date today? Year. It's the twenty second. Yes, the twenty second. Oh my God, Rose! I think we're gonna have to round this up. This is weird. This is I so. Know. I know. We're, I know. It's not like we're, we're ending this channel. We're gonna come back in twenty twenty two, but. It's been such a ride. No, remember, this has been a wonderful... Remember when we started Resi Village? Yeah. At the beginning? Gosh. Liam was so nervous. So nervous to stream. Yeah, Liam, in two streams, Liam was like, boom. He just switched over and he just nothing changed mm. for him. Ever since he's just been, like, taking every feedback quite well. Uh, Liam, yeah. you suck. Okay, <laughs> thank you. Thank you for telling me I suck. I'm taking it very well. Yeah. Oh, God, I don't know what to say. I really don't. No, do you, do you want to end? No, you, well, yes. Okay, well, yeah, I'll just say thank you all so much for supporting us, for helping us grow, for helping, well, just for being with us every Wednesday and also on the additional, like, random days where we can't do a Wednesday or if we have a bonus. Thank you so much for the clips you've been making, for promoting our streams, for just chatting. Honestly, just having you guys chatting away just, just and just talking to you has been an absolute delight for using our emotes and for using our emotes in other streams. We've been seeing Mr. X pop up all over the place. It's <laughs> wonderful. And uh, even if you're just lurking and whatnot, thank you so much for watching. Your participation means a lot to us. And um, it's just been absolute. And Nico, thank you so much for all the graphics and the additional assets and the thumbs you've been making for mm -hmm. buddy games Liam and I are greatly appreciative of that and we've seen yeah. how hard you work on a lot of these so yeah no worries like uh, I'll, you know every thumbnail takes about like an hour if mm. not more like for instance Resident Evil 1 took a lot more um, but yeah they're a lot of fun to make and obviously like thank you for helping to make buddy games grow as well because it's very hard to get exposure on uh, on Twitch and without your support and your your range on your Twitter and stuff, that would have definitely been much, much, much harder. Um, so thank you so much for, you know, helping us out where you can as well. Um, and also thank you to Liam for letting us use his, you know, the buddy game space here. And like he's, yeah. he's the one who lets us use all of his many I, monitors. I will say one of my favorite things that happened this year was that we hit 300 on a 200 special. Yeah, that was and mad. Then we hit 500 on our 300, no, on our alien uh, stream. Mm. That was mad. Um, it's just, you know, we've, we've seen this channel like just keep growing and growing and it's so much fun to, you know, even when we're offline to see this channel like, you know, grow because that to us tells us that not only are people enjoying us online, they're also enjoying the VODs, uh, which we see in the numbers back. So any one of you guys are also watching our VODs like that is so much appreciated. Like I know it's a lot, a lot of gushing right now for some, but it really comes down to that. It, it was really like just so much support that really helps to just keep this 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 pro project of ours afloat because yeah uh the numbers don't lie you guys really are enjoying it and we we really appreciate that so i want to say as well like just because the twitch is telling me that we've got a hype train but the amount of hype trains we've received has been no, mad we got close to hype no train. no i know wait, but it just reminded me that the amount oh, of hype trains that yeah. we have had throughout the six months has been mad. We've had so many hype trains and things, and it's been wonderful. Yeah. Especially, I just remember during Mass Effect, I didn't even know what I could do anymore because there were so many hype trains going on, and I was lost, and it was wonderful. You lost your arm. Yeah, I lost my arm slot. There we go, in my Christmas poncho. <laughs> no, that's not my arm slot. <laughs> what on earth has happened here, poncho? Oh, dear. Where's the arm slot? <laughs> but, yeah, um... Yeah, like you guys have been incredibly supportive um, mm. and it's just great to see this, this channel grow. For for 2022, 
we have lots of big plans as well um we really hope that we can hit uh even bigger numbers we've been talking about what our next goal would be like what, what follower goal we would love to hit but yeah we don't want to jinx it <laughs> i don't know there's no chance in heck that we're gonna hit that um but yeah we want to like create some more like um um, like challenges we were talking about it we yeah, would love we'll just to come up with more stuff we would love to do uh challenges like something like with a baking stream we would love to do that nico really wants to bake i a really cake want to do I, no okay. i just don't just want to make a cake i want to do a challenge i would love to do like a where a speed run where it's like who can make either a cake faster or beat the game faster or something like i've had that in my, in my mind for a while now and i really want to do something like that but yeah uh for now we're just gonna continue to to play video games and then once we we get more tools we get more excitement in things that's when we can start thinking bigger yeah yeah and also, yeah, and also like you know if it wasn't for you guys we wouldn't be able to get the new audio board that we've got here with all the effects and like the the headsets so don't forget the capture card as and well. the capture card yeah capture so card is 100 funded by you guys as well and uh yeah now we have great visuals we have great unique assets every week we have um, better quality sound now so we hope that this will definitely like launch this channel into higher levels of quality because that's where we really want it to be yeah uh, yeah um, we, should Liam, probably, we should probably go now then <laughs> we should go yeah uh, everyone thank you so much for everything like we just said and um, Merry Christmas Happy Hanukkah, happy holidays. Happy holidays, happy everyone. Christmas break, whatever you're going to do this this time of year. Make sure it's a good one. I know it's going to be a difficult one as well for some regions. Um, I really hope that you can somehow still make the best of it. We had to make the best of it as well, just to make it a little bit relatable. Yeah, we're we meant were to so, go to the Netherlands to we, see Nico's family. Yeah, and as you might have picked up on the news, well, my family as well. It wasn't possible. So now Rosie and I are just going to have to, you know, make the best of Christmas. So we're all in it together, you know? So, um, best of luck for everyone out there as well. And I hope you can make something great out of it. We're still on the Discord and stuff, so if you want to have a little chat or something, just just go ahead, mm -hmm. message us. We'll see if we can, you know, chat back. Uh, yeah, and we hope to see you all, of course, in 2022 when we do more streams, more games, uh, hopefully more challenges. And yeah, that's it. So just one more. Mr. Fudico said, hey, my cousin just had twins. No way! That's phenomenal! Uh, that's Congratulations great. to your cousin! Congratulations! Oh, that's wonderful news! <laughs> Yay! Twins! Oh, that's wonderful. What a good way to end the stream. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, we love you all. Uh, Happy New Year as well, for we won't be streaming before the New Year. So Happy New Year. Hope you have the best start to 2022. And we'll see you, yeah, in, in the New Year. Liam, I know you're in the chat. Do you want to quickly say something to the chat? I think he did. He said, Merry Christmas and Happy Holidays. I hope you all have a safe he and did, healthy, yeah. fantastic time and Happy New Year. Right. I think it's time to sign off for Let's now. Let's sign then. off then. And everyone, we'll see you in 2022 for more body game stuff. And uh, yeah, please stay tuned uh, on our Twitter and in our Discord for any news about what we're going to do next. Anyways, we'll see you guys next and time. And our Instagram. And our Instagram. <laughs> Roji manages it. Bye. <laughs> Bye all.